Hello everybody and welcome to Attacking the Darkness! This week we're doing a one-shot special with our special guest here, Greed. Thank you so much for joining What's us. What's up guys? This is exciting. I've been waiting to be able to run this one-shot for so much time now. I'm looking forward to it. So, uh, last time... We had a one shot with TJ being our DM, and we went through a. I can't remember what the campaign was called. Uh, Wolves of Welton. Thank you. Wolves of Welton. Uh, this time it is a homebrew campaign that is actually taking place within the Attacking the Darkness universe. So, to begin with, this campaign takes place ever so slightly into the future where the heroes of the realm have made their way past all the dangers of Waterdeep and have established the Troll Skull Adventuring Guild, also known as the Troll Skull Tavern. At the Adventuring Guild, many adventurers come around to uh, test their mettle in all the, uh, well, all the opportunities that arise from the city itself. This particular evening at the Adventuring Guild, we have a slightly, uh, well, I'd say normally it would be a full bar, but I had to, uh, I turned off my crowd chatter by accident. <laughs> so we have a bit of a full bar and uh, our respective characters who are joining us this week are all within the guild either having a drink or preparing for the evening and bursting through the front door of the uh, bar you see a uh, haggard man a man who looks like he's done many many years of hard labor calluses upon his hands dirt and grime upon his uh, tunic and his pants uh, he comes staggering in through the bar and over towards the large board that has been placed at the far western side of the uh, bar where this is this is where the city watch can come and place uh, wanted ads for help uh, or people who uh, come to contract the guild to do work for them he comes staggering into the bar and up up towards the uh, up to the up to the uh, bulletin board and he begins to tack a little piece of paper up onto the board uh, from behind the uh, ooh, that's why I turned that off uh, he, from the behind the counter Abigail comes and walks over to uh, walks over to the man and goes excuse me can I help you and he goes, he goes oh this is this is this is the adventuring guild right this, this is where I can get help and Abigail goes, well, yes, what's your problem? He goes, every evening, it seems like somebody has come and dug up bodies from the graveyard. And they go missing. Says, I'm at my wit's end. I don't know what to do. I, I need assistance. And uh, Abigail turns and looks and says, well, have you talked to some of the local city watch? There's a couple of city watch uh, guards sitting at the bar er, at the bar as it's become quite known throughout the city watch that this is the place where they can get discounts on drinks. And the city watch uh, turns and looks back at him and just kind of a, not a just an even even uh, even feel to him. It's not nothing you no. Know, anger towards him hey, he goes he goes I've, I've tried contacting the local city watch they they've done everything they can they don't know what else to do they don't know where these bodies are going they don't know who's taking them it's it's so quick in the night and Abigail goes okay well we have some new recruits to the adventuring guild that will probably be best since our normal group of heroes of the realm are out on their latest adventure uh and abigail 
says, turns to him and says, luckily they all happen to be here in the bar today. And she makes her way over to uh, Roshire. And Abigail comes up to you and says, uh, it seems like we've got some sort of uh, body snatching going on for the dead. You fill up for the challenge? That's a hell of a way to say good evening, but uh, I don't see why not. Okay, Roshire, if you want to go ahead and describe your character for everybody. So Roshire is a um, male half, uh, half elf ranger. He stands about 5'10", probably about 170 pounds, uh, around the age of 30. Uh, he normally just does hunting in the forest uh, and sells his goods to the local uh, shops. I look at a little patch on the shoulder and says, I knew I could count on you. Uh, she makes her way around over to uh, Jarl. And uh, Jarl, you're there having a drink after having some uh, a, a crazy time for yourself. Uh, you had come to the yeah. join the adventuring guild in hopes of maybe establishing establishing yourself a little bit more and gaining some attention to yourself. Uh, she comes over and puts her hand on your shoulder and she goes, "Your expertise might be needed in this as well." Body snatching? Is that what I heard? Body snatching. All right, I can do that. I'm in. Excellent. I knew I could count on you and Jarl if you want to go ahead and describe yourself to the audience. All right. So you guys, I see a tiefling, uh, dark gray skin, almost black, uh, black eyes, dressed like your stereotypical wizard, like robes, hat, everything. Uh, my horns actually go through the hat, through the brim of the hat. So it's one of those hats I have to like shove down on my head. <laughs> <laughs> Never graceful, <laughs> and um, and I've got a uh, a large staff with a slightly bluish white sphere up at the top. All right, nice. All right. Abigail, pat you on the shoulder. Thank you so much for taking this on. Uh, then Abigail makes her way over towards Soma and Valgrim. Now you two have been causing a ruckus. All night at your table. Valgrim, you've been trying to keep Soma in check. And Soma, you're just looking to punch anybody in the face who says the wrong thing. <laughs> so, Abigail comes over and pulls a chair out and takes a seat and looks at you two and says, Gentlemen, we've got a pretty dire case here. Seems there's some sort of body snatching going on from the graveyard. They're, I'm putting together a group right now, but we're going to need some muscle and probably some more magic. What do you think? You in? There's always coin available for the adventurers. But you said my magic word. I'm going to look to someone and be like, I think this is a good time to bust heads in. Not here specifically. So I mean the thing, the job. <laughs> well, <laughs> sign me the fuck up. Abigail looks and goes, I knew I knew y'all were going to be perfect for this. Since y'all are the most recent additions to our guild, uh, I'm looking forward to see what y'all can do. And uh, she says, there's a gentleman over there by the bulletin board. He'll be able to fill you in on all the specifics on what you need and where you're going. Uh, thanks for your participation. She gets, stands up and uh, doesn't pat Soma on the shoulder. But Smart. more or less kind of just walks around him and then pats Volgrim and says, <laughs> I'm, yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm going back to the bar. You, you do your thing. <laughs> and he's like a big angry dog he just needs love 
<laughs> and if you two, uh, Volgrim, if you want to start, go ahead and uh, describe your character. And then once you're done, someone, if you want to go ahead and lead in with your, your character description. All right. Uh, Volgrim is a gnome. He is about three foot four, uh, wears leather armor under a long red uh, leather coat. Uh, crazy hair. He's, uh, probably at 90. Um, I don't know why I'm looking up here. I should be looking over here. The camera? <laughs> yeah. Um, and, uh, next to him, well, on the table, I'll go ahead and, on the table, he has this, uh, it kind of looks like an oversized metal Rubik's Cube. And, uh, it has a lot of, uh, if you've seen Critical Role, think of the, uh, the clockwork ball thing they had that put them in a dragon's mm. thing. Mm -hmm. It's like that, but... It looks like a Rubik's Cube, and he can spin it around to do stuff. Spoilers. Oh, sorry. <laughs> <laughs> sorry, everybody. <laughs> um, uh, but yeah, he's fiddling with that, and next to him is a... It looks like a, a, a big clockwork diamond-shaped metal thing, and it occasionally opens up, and it has four legs on each side, and it's, uh, it's a little clockwork turret. I say oh, four sh legs. It's, it's four legs on each half. side? Yeah, like imagine a, a diamond shape. Like each side pops out into a leg, so it like expands and a turret. Oh, oh, four legs one. total, one on yeah, each yeah, side. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. I thought it had like sixteen legs and was like. <laughs> oh, it's too many legs. Too many legs. Fuck, fuck, centipede. God. Mm. <laughs> Stuff of nightmares right there. God. <laughs> That's, that's his next invention now. <laughs> Don't give the DM ideas. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, that's uh, that's Fargum. He's your typical gnome inventor, dude. Nice. That's you, Soma. <laughs> and next, next to him, you see a very grumpy-looking dwarf barbarian. Uh, just over four feet tall. Uh, Shoulder-length red hair with a red beard that comes down into two braids. That are that are like, like, about that long lengthwise. Uh, just has this nasty maul that he just sits on the floor next to him. That's just like this huge chunk of like metal that looks like it wasn't even refined uh, to to be any kind of like normal shape. It's just this huge mass of metal with this giant wooden post sticking out of it um and he's he looks exactly the way you would picture somebody who if you saw them in a dark alley it, you wouldn't try to avoid you would just turn around and run away <laughs> <laughs> he's just the nastiest looking guy you just don't want to fuck with nice okay so Abigail again had just said your guy is over there by the bulletin to board. He's there for your details that you need to start your mission. Uh, and Abigail turns and walks off back behind the bar. So what would y'all like to do? Order breakfast. Uh <laughs> <laughs> sure. I'm just kidding. <laughs> Go ahead, Creed. Uh, can I get a pint to go? <laughs> uh, Abigail sit there and slides over and uh, gets a nice sturdy wooden mug, fills it up. You may need this later, so yeah, go ahead. Yeah. Um, I just grab it and just start chugging and drink about half of it right off the bat. Bargum's gonna and I go his. over and join the other guys okay. by the bolt in the board. Okay. So, uh, no, make way makes way. his way. Roshire makes that way. Uh, Volgrim? Uh, yeah, I'm headed that way. As mm -hmm. I'm going over there, I poke a, I poke the little turret and a, a circular opening opens up and Volgrim sits his mug down inside of that. <laughs> <laughs> nice. Perfect. <laughs> nice. This guy has a fucking cup holder. <laughs> <laughs> And it's all gyroscopic too, so it never spills. It's, yeah. it just like it's perfectly stabilized. Nice. That's fucking awesome. So you, you Where can I get way... me one of those? <laughs> you begin to make your way over there. Uh, Selma, are you making your way over there too? 
Or are you just going to say Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Ab- okay. Absolutely. Just making sure. All right. So you all join uh, the uh, gravekeeper at the uh, bulletin board. And this man is just completely rattled. Uh, it looks like he hasn't slept for days and he's been trying to stay awake. Uh, possibly you guess that he's been staying awake nonstop just to watch over the graves because of so many complaints from family members for the loss of bodies that has been happening at the, uh, at the graves, uh, at the graveyard. Uh, he looks at y'all and he goes, Oh, thank you so much for helping me. Uh, uh, anything I can do, just let me know. Uh, what do you need? Nothing from me. Directions. He goes, I, I can definitely show you where, uh, where it is. Uh, <laughs> Because if y'all, if, if y'all want to follow me, I missed something. It's obviously murdered Curtis. So, uh, he goes, if y'all want to, if y'all, if y'all want to follow me, I'll take you out to the graveyard. Right. And uh, he begins to lead y'all out towards the graveyard. Sounds good. All right. So after yeah, a, uh, okay. Uh, so y'all are walking out towards the graveyard. You're walking through the streets of Waterdeep. Uh, your party is normal, more or less. The, uh, adventure groups have now kind of become the norm for this section of Waterdeep because of uh, the guild that's been established in for Troll Skull and all the things that uh, well the heroes of the realm have done for the city. So uh, you begin to walk out towards. Uh, the graveyard and uh, the graveyard keeper turns to y'all and he says, "Because I've 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 been I've stayed up so many nights just trying to catch a glimpse of what has been what has been stealing the bodies in at night, but I just I have no idea what it is. All I see are gigantic holes where the graves had been uh, previously dug and I laid to rest the dead." holes just like almost body shaped more or less just in the ground and footmarks all leading outside of the uh outside of the graveyard but i I, i'd never see any uh any uh trauma or or any type of dragging for the bodies or any cartwheels i i just don't get it uh I sure hope that y'all can help. Um, so I just guys? want to look around. Oh, yeah. Yeah, let the ranger <laughs> I just want to look around and see if uh, if it's one specific area that's being concentrated on, or if it's just random across the entire graveyard. Okay, you're not quite to the graveyard yet. I'll just kind of give you an opportunity to okay. ask some questions when you get to the before you get to the graveyard. But if nobody has any questions, we can go ahead and jump on to the graveyard. Yeah. Okay. Okay. So, uh, a little small talk. Well, I guess I would there. ask him then. Okay. I uh, what as y'all uh, continue your walk to the graveyard, you're super close by. Um, he says. It seems to be at least for every recent body that I've buried, and even on some of the older graves, it's not really concentrated in one area. It's throughout the entire graveyard. And loved ones from all times, from the most recently to deceased to those who've come to uh, visit those who've passed, they've all come and complained that there's there the grave has been desecrated i i just i don't understand hmm. okay and as you walk into the graveyard uh, you see recent burial sites that the earth has still been turned but there's large holes that have just been pushed out of the ground and even old old decayed uh, tombstones seem to have been knocked over and the earth being freshly pushed up uh, in a strange fashion. So this is what you're seeing right now. Okay. So we're at the graveyard. Yeah. yeah y'all have made it to the graveyard now. Okay. Just for clarification. 
So I'm gonna go ahead. No, go ahead. No, go ahead. I'm reading something. I was just gonna say I, I was gonna look to see if I could find any kind of like footprints or drag marks or stuff that the guy couldn't see for whatever reason. Maybe okay. maybe there are some. He just doesn't know. Okay. Uh, roll an investigation check. Anybody else want to assist with this and roll their own investigation check? Uh, oh, I'm good at that. Yeah, I'm actually, actually I'll do that. Yeah, I'll do that. I hope. I'll tell you what, you all, okay. uh, all of y'all roll investigation check. See what you can find. Y'all are going to kind of split up. Uh, I want to specifically graves. see if there are tracks leading towards the graves, because I have a feeling they might just be leading away. Okay, then roll your investigation checks, and then we'll get numbers. Okay. Um, 20. 19. 23. 11. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. All right. So, my job. We'll, we'll, start, we'll start with you. So, I, you I, go, I was hoping it was going to be survival. Uh, you you go up and you start looking around and you start uh, you put your eye to the ground. And you start looking at the rocks and start looking at dirt. And you're like, it's motherfucking rocks and dirt. Damn it. There's a footprint. There's a footprint. But more or less what you're noticing is just kind of what he's seen. Um, uh, Bogram sees him struggling. And he's going to be like, hey, it's okay, big guy. We'll find it. <laughs> uh, Bogram, you said yours was... 23. Everybody was over 20, I think, except uh, there was a 119. Everybody, well, 19. all y'all cleared the check, yeah. so it was it's fine. Um, what you all begin to see and look at is, um, in some instances, uh, Roshar, you actually see in some of the older graves, there were instances where somebody had come in and dug. You see, you see areas where it looks like a nice clean shovel mark in areas. These are the, the older sections where uh, the tombstone had been desecrated. Uh, Balgrim and Jarl, y'all both notice uh, that in some of the newer areas where the freshly deceased were buried, there weren't any shovel marks. These are all probably about half inch gouges in the dirt. Almost as if you could, uh, looks like maybe fingers had pulled the dirt away and mm. pulled itself from the ground. Hey, I'm, uh, I'm not an expert on dead bodies, but I think these guys dug themselves out. Yeah, that's what it looks like. That's what I was worried about. <sighs> Why does it always have to be self? Something like this. Were you going to say snakes? Snakes, snakes. <laughs> These are snakes. <laughs> I don't, are there snakes here? See a little little rat snake go. Wee! <laughs> Hit it with a fireball. <laughs> oh Jesus! <laughs> I'm just kidding. I don't have a fireball. <laughs> <laughs> or do I? I don't know. I don't know. Um, <laughs> and uh, like I said, Roshire, your your areas that you've seen look like we're all dug up with shovels. Okay, so I'll make my way back to the others and let them know that everybody on the other older sides have been disturbed, but they've been dug up. We shouldn't be doing this. Digging up bodies? There's definitely or? something going on. Yeah, well, yeah, digging up bodies, but digging themselves out too. No, that's like, generally not what did. Typically, yeah. <laughs> and the gravekeeper is, uh, he's listening to y'all talk about this and the, just the look of, the, he, his face is just washed pale and his jaw has fallen slack and he's like, you're telling me the dead have come back? And he's Wouldn't be the first shaking. time, won't be the last. Some of them on their own, some of them are getting some help. He He's visibly shaken, he goes, he goes, well, where could they have gone? What does this mean? Bargram points to the tracks leading away. Probably that way. 
he goes he he goes this is too much for me <laughs> and and he goes he goes i'm going to leave this in your hands uh, i'll i'll be in the uh graveyard keepers uh shack uh if you if 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 you have any other questions and he's just visibly shaken by this he, this man being in his uh mid to late 30s from view he was you could tell that he's probably either a like i said he's the graveyard keeper he'd probably been a farmhand never had never in his life have experienced anything of this nature so he he slowly makes his way back towards the shack i'm just gonna turn and start walking down the the path that we seem to have located Okay. Like not even ask it permission, just go. All right. Uh, okay. So you're y'all are now gonna try and follow the tracks that you've discovered with your investigation that led out of the graveyard. So. Well, I know I am. I need. Mean, well. <laughs> Rock of Vulgram. All right. So him. yeah, you see, you see, uh, uh, Jarl and Roshire. You see Vulgram, and uh, you see Soma leading the way, and Vulgram, uh, uh. Wobbling along, trying to catch up. I do not wobble. <laughs> <laughs> Running with very short legs. I scamper. You scamper. I, you what's scamper what's your movement along. speed, Vulgar? Uh, yeah, twenty-five. 25. Yeah. yeah, I'm I'm thirty-five, so I have a little bit of a longer stride than you. I jump on top of my turret. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> turret <laughs> your turret goes. <laughs> it sinks a little bit. He forgot to speed. take his mug off first, so he just, like, inserted. <laughs> oh. I've got my head down in one of the graves still, so I don't actually see him leave until they're about 100, 150 feet off. Oh, shit. And then... <laughs> shit. Down the rest of my ale and just book it <laughs> towards them. I'm keeping pace. Okay, so uh, y'all and Roshire, y'all come in uh, to try to catch up. Um... Soma, I need you to give me a, a survival check to see if you can follow these footprints. That shouldn't be too bad. Hey, just what you were asking for. I know, right? <laughs> yeah, it's almost as if you need to do this to find the footprints. Or at least follow them. Uh-oh. This shouldn't be uh, so bad, he says. Whoops. It's an eight? Sorry, Creed. <laughs> All right. So... Uh, you marching along I know where it is yep follow me you keep walking you walk for about 10 minutes you lost the tracks I just turn around and I go well fuck I'm lost <laughs> <laughs> you'll all get, catch up to uh, Soma finally and uh, he turns and tells everybody that he's fucking lost and uh, y'all are going to have to uh, need another survival check for y'all backtracking to try and find where Soma lost the trail. Uh, I look back at Roshire and I'm like, hey, you look like you're uh, out in the wilderness type of guy. Think you <laughs> could uh, lead the way with these tracks. So, I'll look at him and uh, it's like, yeah, let me take a shot at this. So I start looking around and then uh, I roll 17 for survival. Okay, yeah. Uh, you backtrack five minutes, six minutes, seven minutes. You stop and you look. You say, ah, there they are. And then you signal to everybody that you've picked up the trail again. And you begin to, you all begin to follow the trail. And the trail leads you out towards, uh, more towards the outskirts of the city. Um... It, it's skirting the outside edge, kind of along the wall. And as you get closer and closer to a large gate, you see a, uh, a large sewer section or a grating more or less that has been slightly tampered with. It's not sitting flush. It's not suspicious at all. That's probably nothing. Yeah, let's keep moving. 
<laughs> Do we want to go in there? I don't really want to go in there. Nobody wants uh, to go in there. The tracks seem to leave. But I want to look yeah, at it. Sewer. The tracks. I want to say, I'm gonna. If you make me check, I'm gonna make sure that the tracks do go towards it. Roll a perception check. Yeah. No need for the investigation on this. You know about it. Well, twenty-one is perception. Okay. Yeah, you definitely see the tracks going poop right into it. So whether you want to or not, it looks like this is where we gotta go. Oh shit! All right. Just didn't want to get my robes dirty. It all washes off eventually. So I'm going to try to move the grating. Okay, uh, give me a strength check. Ha, <laughs> you don't want me to do this. <laughs> you said it. <laughs> oh, shit. Uh, What's that, Curtis, rolling high? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Strength check was a 19. Yeah, 19. In, in a most uncanny way that Soma, you seem to be kind of jealous about because you're the muscle here. Roshire hooks this. I mean, he just whips it up this large metal grating up over his shoulder and then toss it behind him, opening up the grating. Golf, golf claps from the audience. I'm impressed. <laughs> Me too. I could have thrown my back out. <laughs> <laughs> Should be more careful. Just oh, the side of next, okay. ne <laughs> next time you can ask me if you want. But... Yeah, that's a good idea. I think I need to sit down. <laughs> oh, oh, oh. All right. Roshire sits down. And as he sits down. On a dead to... guy. You don't sit down. <laughs> you sit down and you begin. Uh, uh, it's a small rest to get your back in order. Uh, I'm all right. At this point in time, okay. So are you all ready to enter the sewers? Uh, yep. Now or never. All right. Y'all begin to make your way down into the sewers, and at I'll this lead point, the way. Okay. And at this point, I'm gonna do a little thing here because we're going into sewer crawl mode. Whoop. For everybody to... I'm going to make a sound effect for you. Okay, you can make a sound effect for me. <laughs> and for... You oh! Guys... Ooh, that was fancy. Damn! Oh. Oh, there we that's go. so cool. <laughs> that's pretty. All right, and now we're going to switch over here. Uh... Pause this music here and begin to hear. I gotta pee. The ever so sound. This would be the place for it. <laughs> of the sewer below water deep. Smells like hot garbage and old dead people. <laughs> Probably about 70% of what's in here, so yeah. <laughs> All right. So, y'all entered into the sewers. You take the ladder down, and uh, inside the sewers, you at first you only have one direction. And for, for everybody watching, and for everybody that's uh, looking at the video, north is going to be where the ladder is, south is going to be the south, the bottom. West is left and east is right. So we're just going to make it easy that way. Just apply a cardinal compass right smack dab and north, south, west, east. So you have an opening to your east that you can traverse. To the west is a uh, looks more like almost like a cutoff section with a, uh, a drain pipe into the sewer. If you want, you can continue to... Make your investigation checks and see if you can find your way. I leave that to your discretion, Marty. How dark is it in here? Uh, it is... It is fairly, fairly dark in here. Those with dark vision, 
it's just fine. Those who do not have dark vision, you will need some sort of torchlight. Well, that's okay. I'm going to just tap my staff on the ground and the, the orb just lights up bright Ow. blue. All right. Right. Ow. Yeah. Ow, my dark vision. <laughs> it's a little bit jarring. Yeah, Yarl. sorry. I dim it a little bit. <laughs> you see Yarl make a uh, light emerge from his staff. Amazingly enough, there is a giant blue bulb on the top of this mini that we're using for you. Oh, perfect. <laughs> that works. It's like crazy perfect. Uh, <laughs> so, where would y'all like to go? Uh, East. If yeah, Volgrim's going to look to the wall and be like, I think we should go that way. <laughs> Not at the wall the other way, the open way. All right. So you all make your way to the east? Sure. I like that little loading thing. That was cool. <laughs> There's no reason it needs to be that fancy, and I love it. <laughs> <laughs> That's excessively fancy. This is every reason to play. By the way, <laughs> yeah. uh, this is the brand new tech that I've been talking about for probably about a month now that we're going to be implementing into the homebrew sessions. This is what our homebrew sessions are going to be. So I yeah, fucking love it. Just for it's everybody nice. out there, uh, this is what I've been working on behind the scenes and TJ as well. So that did nothing. Yeah, we've. I'm been, here for moral we've support. Been, <laughs> we've been talking about this stuff for a while. I'm trying to been put in the effort here. So y'all make your way east into uh, into the uh, into the sewers. Uh, again, more. Sewage and seepage seems to be through the area. Uh, you have an exit to the east and an exit to the west. And uh, I need a quick perception check from the party. Ooh. 20 again. Okay. That's a natural one. <laughs> Only slightly yeah, I can't than see I got, shit, y'all. I got, I, I'm the second highest with an eight. <laughs> oh, right. God. So nobody sees room. anything but me? <laughs> yeah. God. Okay, uh, Roshire. In the distance. God. TJ, help him see, out, bro. <laughs> in the distance, you happen to see a, uh, a little bit of a shambling mass pulling itself up out of the sewage. Its jaw hanging loose. Going... How far away is it? Uh, this is probably 5, 10, 15, 20, 90 feet away. Probably exactly 90 feet. I wouldn't be able to see it without being 60 feet away then. You could hear it. I can hear you, it. Hey, you, you rolled really well on your perception check, plus you have uh, light emanating from the staff okay i'll it's take dim, that then. it's dim light up to 120 yeah, it's yeah. normal light up to 60 i think uh okay. no i think it's just out to 20 oh just 20 uh bright for 20 dim for another 20 oh, okay so 40 okay so you hear a noise then you don't see okay. it, but that's what you see here in a minute uh you I'll hear tell, uh... you hear clack 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 as everybody else is looking at the ground for uh Footprints. I'll tell uh, Soma. Was Soma leading the way? Yep. Yep. I'm I'm in front. Okay. I'll be towards the back. I'll tell Soma that uh, I hear some rustling up ahead. Okay. I'll move. Uh, I'll move thirty-five feet. Uh, preferably not in the water. <laughs> <laughs> just, just FYI. I, uh, you gotta say stuff like that. <laughs> I'm gonna take your most direct path there. Uh, you, everybody sees him kind of slowly begin to fade out of the light source. Uh, I'm gonna stay within I, where I can see him. Soma, do you have dark vision? I do, 60 feet. 60 feet? Okay. It's outside your peripheral right now? Well, no, actually, it should be within your peripheral. Just
just barely on the outside edge, you see a very, a very thin, gately creature. Gately. Gately. It walks with a gate. Oh. Kind of dragging its sword on the ground, going <laughs> clack. Are we? Clack. Are we doing turn-based stuff right now? Nah, more or less. I mean, I mean, nah. it, it's it's a skeleton. Okay, I'll uh, I'll keep going down towards him. Okay, is everybody else following uh, behind him? Yeah, I'm, I'm gonna stay about uh, yeah, I'm... twenty feet behind him. All right, and I'll be next to Balgram, just trying to keep the light as far forward as I can. I'm gonna have to go the other way. Uh, all right, so eventually. You make contact, and you all see that this is a this is a uh, a skeleton, uh, ragged, straight up bones. It has a sword in its hand that looks like it's uh, ancient and rusty, and it is going to uh, try to take a strike at you, uh, Soma, but. Uh, since you saw him first, go ahead and you take your attack first. Take my okay. Yeah. Uh. All right. Uh, that's gonna be a seventeen to hit. Oh yeah, that's gonna. Hit. Okay. And let me get my hit dice out. Sorry, sorry. sorry. How dare you! Didn't plan on killing anything today. <laughs> oh, shit. Okay, S uh, seven damage. Seven damage? Oh, okay. All right, seven damage. That's disappointing. Now, now it's going to take a strike at you. Oh, it's good to be me. Uh, 19 to hit. Oh, yeah, it hits. All right. The... Six damage. He just brings his rusted sword across your chest, slashing you. Uh, everybody else, uh, you can go ahead and take an action if you so desire. I want to reposition myself towards the middle. Am I in the very back? Yeah, you're right in the very back. I want to take a step back and move more towards the middle, where I can get a shot with it, a shot on him. Uh, he still got some. He still got some cover from him. So I'm gonna say his AC is plus two. I um, ignore uh, half and three quarter cover. Okay, Mr. Sniper. <laughs> <laughs> Go ahead and take your shot. And I will. I need a little. That is a f fifteen to hit. That'll hit. That is ten points of damage. Boom! Bones shatter and explode across the ground. Uh, for all intents and purposes, it's dead. Uh, you see the bones on the ground, they begin, they go click, 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 click. And I'm gonna, kind of... I'm gonna scoot them into the water with my foot. Well, as you go to kind of kick your, uh, kick the water, you see the bones start to, uh, shake and then move on the ground a little bit and then scrape across the ground a little bit more all right yeah, I'm, uh, I'm, I'm not i'm not about that i'm casting frostbite so it's a con save 16 okay before you cast give me one second let me check something yeah okay you begin to prepare your frostbite the bones Start sliding towards each other, towards the mass again, but stop. And then quit moving. Okay. I don't want you to burn anything. <laughs> I failed my, uh, I failed my save. Um, so everybody now has seen that this thing has was 
in the sewers and for some reason has some sort of additional magical essence that began to try to put itself back together. Yeah, I'm, I'm still going to cast it because I don't like that. That, <laughs> that. <laughs> All right, go ahead and roll, uh, roll your attack. Uh, yeah, just roll your attack on it. Okay, well, it's a con save 16 for... Hollow bones, it fails. <laughs> yep. All right, cool. Eight damage, and if it has a next attack roll, it has disadvantage. You see, <laughs> well, you see the bones that are on the ground just boof turn into powder. Nice. This thing is gone now. I don't think the powder is going to attack us. You suddenly see the powder slowly start. <laughs> <laughs> no, no, no. Uh, okay, so uh, that just happened. Uh, go ahead and leave it up. Open it up to y'all. All right, I'll um, I'll scoot the rest of the I'll, I'll scoot the dust into the water with my foot. Okay, you kind of push some of the dust off into the water, and it begins to soak into the sep uh, the sewer and the uh, the sewage. That's gonna come and back as some kind of poo monster. Noise. All right, and then I'll just continue east. Barreling ahead <laughs> with no discussion, uh, Soma begins nope. to uh, power towards the east. If they want to tell me to stop, they can, but I'm just huh. keep going. He's very headstrong. We should, yeah, know. let's just follow. <laughs> All right. I'll fall in. They don't care. <laughs> You all fall in line and continue heading to the east. We got a job to do. We know where we're going. And uh, you, you see a blind curve to the north. Okay. If he runs into something, it's fine. He can handle it. He's a tough little guy. I would... I will continue around that curve. However, I will approach it on the long curve side. You're going to approach so it on the, the long curve side. Okay. Yeah, so... So the, the southern side of the map, and then curve around the long side. Okay, and everybody else, are y'all taking south side or north side? I would uh, be south. I'm going to be on the north, just like right before the corner. Okay. All right. So. Let me pick this up right quick. Oops. You need one of those grandpa grabbers so you can reach out there and move the pieces easier. <laughs> grandpa grabbers. <laughs> that sounds horrible. <laughs> Come here, Grandpa. <laughs> oh, that's my jubilates. All right. <laughs> Put me down. <laughs> so as y'all are waking your way from the south side and the north side, uh, on the north on the north side, Greet, I'm gonna need you. To make a dexterity save. Oh. Yarl, I need you to make a dexterity save. Okay. Uh, 12. 12? Okay, yeah. yeah. You, uh... Being of the arcane nature, you, as you're walking, notice at the bottom of the ground, or on the, on the ground itself, on the uh, edge near the water, there seemed, there was a... Uh, a glyph placed into the ground. Fortunately for you, at the last second, you happen to see it and you jump back. So you're only going to take half damage. Okay. <laughs> oh, lucky mm. bum. You take one point of acid damage. Okay. I have rolled magically two ones. <laughs> Ray roll. Perfect. Keep, keep it up. I'm gonna look over at him on the other side and be like, "You wanna, you wanna come over here?" <laughs> it's probably safer over there now. I'm gonna just be a little bit more careful. Yeah. <laughs> Maybe I'm we good. should be checking for traps. Probably. Yeah. After that, uh, I'd say so. I like okay. having feet. All right. If you, you lose yours, I can build you some. <laughs> we'll talk about that. <laughs> I just give him a strange look. All right, you see, you all see the path in the north. Okay. 
Just we'll proceed by uh, checking for traps. All right. Uh, Are you going to be in front, Roshar? I mean, I, yeah. If we're going to be looking for traps, I would assume that uh, it's going to take a keen eye. I'm, I'm not looking for traps. <laughs> <laughs> Oma's not going to look for traps. Uh, Roshire, okay, I want you to make an investigation check. Mm, I'll go ahead and look on my side as well. Okay. All right, so, so 19. Go, I'll go ahead and make an investigation check as well. Ooh, investigation. Uh, 24. Okay. Uh, as you both continue, uh, you begin to point out little small arcane traps that have been placed on either side of the walkway inside the sewers very small ones they don't look as they don't look powerful they look like the ones that uh exploded right on you jarl and you begin to uh point out saying there's one there's one they're not massive and everywhere but they are placed somewhat throughout the area so as you make your way towards the north you come Good. to straight away bridge that isn't out good so there's some overarching uh overarching bridges and uh a clear straight away to the north nothing nothing appears in there other nothing than us Nothing in here at the moment other than y'all. Hmm. All right. I, we'll I continue, continue north. north. Yeah. yeah. All right. You I feel continue. like this is too empty. <laughs> you continue making your way towards the Why north. did our DM chuckle? <laughs> <laughs> oh, God. You continue to make your way to the north. There, uh, This room didn't have any traps. Uh, you make up to a nice large crossway. Shit where on. you have oh, God. All right. west, north, and east that you can uh, walk to. I'm going to look back at Volgrim and be all like, uh, I don't know. <laughs> I, I say let the tracker guy handle it from here. God. So I'm still looking around trying to uh, figure out which way we need to go. Okay, uh, roll an investigation. Uh, I know you need to roll. I need to roll survival. Anybody who's going to still look for traps, I need an investigation. I'll look for traps. Okay. So I'll roll 17 for survival. All right. 22 for investigation. 22 for investigation. Okay. Uh, you, again, notice a large uh, a number of uh, arcane traps. That have been sprinkled out through the area and with some deft movement you can uh avoid them for uh for the location inside here you notice footprints that are uh traveling to the north footprints traveling east not so much anything really traveling west okay It looks like there's quite a bit of traffic to the north and to the east. Mm. Sounds like we should go west. My natural inclination is always turn left. Else you're getting lost. I say, <laughs> I'm <I'll> go <west. laughs> over there, just like, what the fuck? Did they not <laughs> hear me? <laughs> just looking around, like, <laughs> I should be by myself. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so I'll let's... argue my point. <laughs> <laughs> all right, so all right, go ahead. I mean, this is all y'all. Y'all got to determine which way you want to go. Can I determine whether the footprints are coming and going from the same direction? Both and coming and going from north and south, and uh, for the north and south, from the north they're coming and going, and from the east they're coming and going. There's none to the west. There's none to the west. That sounds suspicious. It does. Is that a body that just floated through the water? Maybe. <laughs> make, make an investigation check. She says out loud. <laughs> Roll a Is that a body? <laughs> Roll a perception check. <laughs> I, I did say that. It's 18. That's a piece of wood. <laughs> 
I don't know about this guy so much. <laughs> That was that clearly was a, big a log. piece of wood. <laughs> that piece of wood had arms and legs. It did. <laughs> um, this is what we would call a red herring. I don't know if those are here on this world, but they're they're meant to deceive. And I think we should go west. Unless that's what the DM wants us to think. What's a DM? Da 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 da. <laughs> <laughs> oh. <Lightning> strike crackle. <laughs> <laughs> All right, I uh, I flip a coin. Do, do, does anybody got a coin? Uh, <laughs> roll, roll a d six. I was gonna say yeah. Odds and evens. Yeah, odds and evens. Six, odds and evens. I mean, it doesn't matter. Any dice will do. Uh, okay. All right, so I start heading east. All right, we're going to head east. <laughs> okay. Someone begins trudging east. Stubborn asshole. That's just one way to pick, yeah. <laughs> Anybody following him? I'm yeah. following him. All right. Sure. Solves that problem. All right, so we're going east. I love this. Oh, I love this. Okay, uh, you come to a blind curve heading south. Uh, I will be on the long curve side again. So the north side of the... The tunnel. Yeah, I'll stick with the long side as well. <laughs> Learned your lesson last time, did you? <laughs> blown off, yeah. <laughs> I'm going to be ahead of him looking for traps because I know he's not. <laughs> <laughs> Roshar? I'm on the other side. Oh, shit. Check it for traps. Haven't we learned this lesson? All right. <laughs> I need uh, I thought I turned this off. I'll fix that. Okay. I need uh, investigation checks from Roshire and Volgrim. Uh, I got a nat 20, which comes out to a 28. Damn. God, 28? You can see everything. You see the shit I'm looking for. <laughs> 18. 18? Okay. You notice that both the north and the south side are riddled with arcane traps along the uh, concreted, or, well, not really concrete, but the cobbled uh, walkways in the sewer. Like, walking on the cobble is going to be dangerous. I just start firing arrows into them. <laughs> Okay. <laughs> you shoot <laughs> you shoot him with arrows. It doesn't go off. Oh. Can I Should tell we... how deep the water is from where I'm at? Uh like a perception check. That's oh god. Was... That's a nat twenty. Thigh deep. You just thigh like... so I'm oh. underwater. <laughs> Wait, yeah. Yeah, thigh deep for him would be like neck level, like chest to neck level for me. <laughs> this is great. I'm telling you, this is the wrong way. <laughs> well, do we want to at least check? Oh, the other ways. I don't know if that was intentional, but we lost TJ in the. <gasps> okay, <laughs> I'm sorry. You lost me. We're you're no. You disappeared for you're good now, but oh, weird. yeah, you're fine. Just, okay, you're so fine. what were you gonna say, Creed? Do we want to check the other directions to see if they're not this trapped? I'm okay with it. Yeah, I mean, if everybody's gonna turn around, I'm gonna have to. I'm gonna stay with them. I don't want my head underwater in poo water. I'm just putting that out there. Just, just FYI, Volgrim. If we go into the water, I can put you on my shoulders. Oh yeah, good. Not, I'm not. glad you can. I can't. <laughs> I hurt right, my look. back. <laughs> <laughs> so, I'm I'm good. All right, let's and go back. Then... Let's right, go back go the go way back? we came and and I'll and, and head north. You gonna head north? Okay. Yeah. All right. As you head north, Roshar got butt hurt about west. <laughs> <laughs>
Okay, you head north and uh, there's a long hallway leading straight ahead. Check this one for traps, too. Okay, roll an investigation check. Get to it, nerds. Uh, what is it? 22? Is that 14? No, 23. 23? Arcane traps everywhere on your side. Same thing here. Everywhere. I don't understand why there's so many, so much traffic and then so many arcane traps. Oh, magic's easy. You can just set it to trigger on people you don't want yeah. it to trigger on. Just kind of slap it down. You'd be like, hey, these are my guys. Don't set off when they step on it. But if some other you guys come through, this whole cave will go up. How much do you weigh, Volgrim? Not much. I don't know. I didn't actually go out of the weight. Probably... 40 pounds, 50 pounds. Mm. Throw him. It's a, <laughs> it's that's what I was thinking. I was like, uh, maybe a little gnome sensitive. tossing? <laughs> <laughs> I'm not going to throw him. It's not true D&D &D until you throw the gnome. <laughs> <laughs> well, Roshire, how about checking the western tunnel? <laughs> I'd give him some, some attitude. <laughs> Just turn and look at him. You first. All right, I'll, I'll head back and then west. All right, y'all make your way to the west. And what you notice at the end of the wall is a dead end with a with a uh, out spot, a spate of uh, sewage pouring out from the wall again. That's the way we came in. It looks similar, but no, <laughs> this is not the way you came in. Trust me. Uh, I want to. I wouldn't do that to you. <laughs> Sort of MC Escher sewer system. I only have a limited amount of sewers. <laughs> at the point of being able to see the wall at the back of it, I just scoff. I want to go over there and check the wall. All Actually, right. I want to check for traps on my way to the wall. Okay. Uh, roll your investigation. Uh, 23? There's nothing trapping the wall. Nothing trapping on the floor. Cool. Uh, I want to check the wall, see if it's real. Uh, if there's you any way through it. Touch the wall. Solid. Doesn't seem to be any type of uh, uh, faux wall built into it. Um, is that ladder going up, or is that not in this? I mean, that take yeah, it, it goes up. It'll go back out into the city. It'll be a block over from where you were. Okay. <laughs> you estimate from uh, your travel in the sewer so far. Okay, I was wrong. Sorry. Why is there a dead end of this? This is weird. Hey, people who design sewers don't have a lot of things to do. So. Shit's, shit's got to get in here somehow. Yeah. Uh, listen, uh, civil engineering is very important to the growth of a city. Don't get me wrong, it's important. Have you seen some of the assholes running this city? No, I'm new here. <laughs> Take some time, you'll learn. I'd rather not. I turn and I go back towards the four-way. Same. Alright. So they're spending a lot of effort to protect whatever's to the north and to the east. There could be a good chance that these both these paths end up in the same direction or in the same place. Maybe. If we got a pick, I vote north and just try and avoid as much as we can. Okay. <laughs> 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 Someone just says, okay, it turns around and starts walking north. All right. That's about it, yeah. Um, At this point, it doesn't take much to convince me. So I'm going to continue ever. north. Okay. Is everybody going north? Yeah. All right. You all go north. Remembering on the west side where the traps are. Nobody looked at the east side yet. Has anybody traveled the east side? Didn't hurt to check. I'll be on the west side. Uh, I'll take the east and check it. Okay, go ahead and run your check on traps. Oh, I'm going to check over his shoulder. because I'm 16. It. All right. Uh, what's 16? 20 something. 20 something. 20. I can math. Hold on. 24. I can math? 24. Can math. Sorry. <laughs> yeah, there's traps on the east side as well. Great. Hmm. Arcane traps. I hit him with a firebolt. 
See what happens? <laughs> Nothing happens. These traps suck. <laughs> or they're I, good. I, I step on the first one that I know. You step on it, a trap? Yep. <laughs> All right. Make a dexterity uh, save. I have advantage on dexterity effects that I'm aware of. Okay. Would I have advantage on this? Yeah. You're Are aware you of the trap? Intentionally run over every one of them. <laughs> Ooh, that one's a 19. Okay, so that's... Uh, uh, that's 22. Okay, yeah, you, uh... You definitely are able to dash, uh, jump out of the way. Whoops. But you take... Uh, four points of acid damage. Alright, yeah, trap still hurt. Yeah, they usually do. Uh, yeah, he's Roshar's just trying to <laughs> Avoid a headache at this point. I want to. I want to look in the water and see if there's any traps, uh, like along the the bottom of the thing. Okay. Yeah. Go ahead. You gonna jump into the sewage and look look at the bottom well, of the? Uh... I was hoping to peer through the water. I don't want to get in it. Okay. Well, I'll, I'll tell you what. I'll let you do that. DC will be a little bit higher. All right. Uh, well, wow, that was terrible. Uh, seven plus eight. 15? Yeah. Boy, it looks super safe. Okay. Water's probably okay, but I'm not getting in it. I'll hop in. So much. <laughs> so much. Cannonballs! <laughs> I don't. Okay, I don't cannonball. <laughs> but. <clears throat> you hop yeah, in the water. Yeah, I'll uh, just hop in. Nothing seems to happen. How high does the water come to me? I'm, I'm four foot. You're swimming. Oh, well, well, no. You're four foot? Uh, yeah, I'm four foot, it was, too. It was thigh level of a six foot person so you got your head above water i got my like, head above water okay like chest high yeah you're like kind of neck to chest high in the water going wading through it Ugh. all right i'll i'll gesture to volgram to get on my shoulders <laughs> he looks he begrudgingly gets on your shoulders all right make a dexterity check for me volgram oh boy dc's low it's gonna be 10 oh then uh natural 16 oh you're fine you can balance. You bet. You're able to balance on his head. Uh, it, what's your mechanical turret gonna do? Uh, it 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 closes up and it carries it on his back. Okay. All right. So you're carrying it. You're in the water. Oh. What's everybody else doing? God, I hate this. And I'll hike up my robes a little bit and get in the water. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Hikes up his robes and immediately soaks them to his waist. <laughs> yeah, I'm jumping in the water, or I'll step into the water. All right. Y'all begin to. Uh, Slowly trudge your way to the north through the uh, sewage. Filth. <laughs> Filth. You go to the north. I got stuff like chunks hitting me and ugh. Oh, don't say <laughs> chunks. Oh. Every, every now and then a dead rat floats by. I want to grab one of the dead rats and put it in my pocket. Don't do that. Take that out of your pocket right now. You got a dead rat <laughs> in your pocket. <laughs> I ignore Volcom. <laughs> You're so weird. <laughs> All right, Inventory. it's another. Uh, it's a uh, another uh, straight way to the north. Um, Y'all are in the sewage. What would you like to do? You want to stay in the sewage, or you want to, or get out and walk on the? <laughs> I want to check for traps. <laughs> Where are you checking for traps? If we're gonna get out, I want to check the area for traps. Okay, <clears throat> go ahead and check the area for traps. Oh, I'm not having a good time in this mess. Uh, investigation, this one would be 12. Mm. You don't seem to see any traps that are out there on the cobble. How's it looking? I mean, I, I'm, I can't tell. There's, I, I don't like where we're standing. <laughs> I can't feel. Strong suit. <laughs> I, I can't. The smell is making me sick. <laughs> I, want, I want to check before he jumps up there. All right, go ahead. Oh, I'm not going to see shit. Uh, I hope you don't see shit because it's been floating <laughs> in and around us. Um, four plus 12. 12 also total? 12. <laughs> yeah. yeah. You're, you're both pretty confident that there's no more uh, arcane traps up there. Uh, it's good to me. Pull the shit out of my beard. <laughs> oh. It's like urine soaked. Gross. 
<laughs> All right. So is everybody up on the edge? Yes. Are we at the middle walkway or the the you far were, north one? Y'all are crawling out. Down. Down there. Okay. Are you calling out north side or, or west side or east side? Well, let me check the other side then. I just hold on. You just check for traps. On one side, right? <laughs> Which side did you check for? I was on. The, I guess I was still on the left. All right. So you checked over here and didn't look like there was anything there. So was he know, on the other? TJ, were you on the other side or were you, you with checking? me? Were you checking east or west? No, uh, you... For fun, I checked the other side. <laughs> okay. But we don't know. <laughs> it looks good. All right. <laughs> Where's everybody else? Where? Uh, if I'm on that side, then so is Soma. Yes. Guess I'll be my, my dwarf sub submarine. Yeah. Okay. Is there we go. Just north of us, something we can go under, or yeah, y'all yeah, were able to go under the entire way. Those okay. are all bridges over the uh, sewage. Okay. Cool, cool, cool. Okay, so you're all climbing out. I I'm waiting for someone else to. <laughs> I don't. Ah, uh, yeah, fine. I'll get okay. out. I'm Yo, tired of being in this. Climb out. Uh, who else is climbing out? I mean, I'll start to climb I'm, out. Whether he wants to or not, I'm going to toss Bulgrim up top. <laughs> ah, no! <laughs> All right, I need everybody to make a deck save. God damn it. <laughs> this is some bullshit. Uh, Natural 18 plus stuff. Natural 18 plus stuff? Yeah, you're going to take half damage. You're fine. <laughs> 18. You're going to take half damage. Uh, 14. Okay. Saving? Fuck. Yeah. 13. Uh, Roshire and Volgrim, you'll take full damage. Ah! Full damage, eight points. Half damage, four points. Alright. You begin to get the idea that this whole area in these walkways are trapped beyond doubt. All right. Get back I, in the water. Yep. Just... I, same thing. God damn it. It's right back into the poop water. Everybody into the poop water. Yeah. <laughs> All right. Climb back on his shoulders and smack him in the head. All right. Patience, uh, man. Patience. Okay. You're. You can go back south or continue yeah. traveling north. You the one. You're the one who said it was safe. <laughs> I was hoping someone else would go up there first. North. Yeah. All right. <clears throat> Got a blind corner to walk, the east. Walking in this bullshit for an hour. We don't know if it's bullshit. Could be Torin. Could be Minotaur. <laughs> Minotaur would be bullshit. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> All right. I'm going to curve around the corner along the long side wall. All right. In so the I water still? Be... Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay. All right. <clears throat> So you oh. all begin to make your way through the through the sewage, yep. and uh, make your way. Uh, Y'all all heading east, I'm assuming. Mm -hmm. Okay, yeah, no problem. Don't seem to run into anything. Nobody checked for anything in the water, but there was nothing there. And now we're getting to some areas where it's a little bit broken up, but there's still sections of sewage that you're going to be able to. Uh, Tread are, are those are those air okay so there's the center path going down the center and then there's a little bridge connecting the edges to the center yes are, are the little bridges able to be walked underneath no you're gonna actually have to go so we'll have to get out okay. you'll have to get out and go over those hmm. okay Volgram. Okay, all right how good are you at swimming i can swim just fine i just don't want to do it in poop water all right so i'm gonna go up to to the first bridge on the south side. Uh-huh. And I'm going to I'm going to grab Volgrim and I'm going to try to toss him over the bridge into the poop water on the <laughs> oh other God. side. All right. <laughs> All right. Give me a strength check. <clears throat> Just strength, not athletics. Strength. Strength straight. Okay. Uh 22. Oh yeah, you send the gnome flying. <laughs> 
<laughs> Tomo, what the fuck? Do I, you shut your mouth! <laughs> do I hear a splash on the other side? Yeah, you hear a splash on the other side. Bloosh! No trap goes mm. off. <clears throat> Anybody else want to go? I'm gonna just climb over. I'll take the, I'll take the damage if, if it means getting out of this water. You can take an investigation check if you want to see. I, I mean, sure. I'll see if there's an area where there's not any. Okay. Uh, nineteen. Yeah, you find a little path where you can probably squeeze through without any damage. I'll follow him. Yep, going Same. that way. I'll follow the two of them. <laughs> Fulgrim, you're just kind of like splashing there as you see them kind of tread around through that safe area. <laughs> Fucking asshole. <laughs> so, we talked about this. Patience. You're safe, right? I'm fucking gross. I'm gonna get hepatitis Well, I know or that. <laughs> <laughs> I, I pick him back and put him on my shoulders again. <laughs> okay. So now, like, uh, his, his poop pants are, like, soaking into my shoulders. Uh, <laughs> Alright. Uh, Y'all heading... Uh, East in the sewage or on the uh I'm staying in the, in the sewage. <laughs> no, we're just gonna make tracks to the east where we're at. In the sewage. Yeah. Yep. Okay. Alright. Y'all make your way in through the sewage to the east and you come across a Oh my uh, god. Another four way. I hate mazes. Uh, is anybody even writing this down? Nope. <laughs> we went we went north of the last passage. Yeah. <clears throat> and it was straight the whole way until here, basically, so. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> oh, no. Stuff. <sighs> Somebody's in the water. No, it's uh, just wood. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> All right. I don't know if we see that, though. Not at this distance. But you can make a perception check if you're going to see if you can hear something. Yeah, I'll oh. do that. I was saying you hadn't been up to this point, but it's up to you. I would have been keeping an ear out. Okay, go ahead. Roll your perception. 8 <laughs> All you hear is running sewage water. I'm going to start my way forward towards the cross <clears throat> in okay. the water. I, I will precede him, just FYI. Like, if he's going to go, I'm going to make sure I stay in front of him. I'm just trying to get some light in the area. Okay. As you draw closer, now you begin to hear... Clack, clack, clack. Clack, clack. 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 There we go. So I'll ready my bow. Yeah. Then something catches the attention. They see a shiny light object and they begin to make their way towards y'all. Are they in the water or are they up top? Or a mixture? They're in the water and up top. Okay. <clears throat> I will, uh, I would like to in engage them. Hey, well, we're going to roll initiative. Yay. Hey. Yay. Uh, as he's, uh, uh, as those guys appear, I want to jump off his shoulders onto the ledge. Okay. No problem. You do it. Roll a quick dex check. Oh. DC eight. Oh, uh, 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 <laughs> uh eight. You make it. <laughs> Barely. You like hop off his shoulders and then you start to fumble forward and you like hop on one foot. Like, uh, 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 uh. And you're good. <laughs> ah. Uh, oh, initiative. I should roll that too. Yeah, you should roll initiative. Uh, that's not good. Oh. Yeah. All right. Okie dokie. I need Matt, thank you for your short name. <laughs> oh yeah, yeah, yeah. You just call me Val. <laughs> Alright. Uh twenty five twenty. 
Nobody. 20 to 15. 18. 15 to 10. 12. 12. Yeah, 12. Summer. 10. Oh, I don't like these things. So, it's... all right. Okay. So first up is gonna be Roshire. Okay. So the two that are closest to me, mm -hmm. I will attack the one on the left. Okay. That is a twenty-one to hit. Oh, that'll hit. D eight plus three is ten points of damage. All right. Okay, anything else? And then uh, using Horde Breaker, Ooh. I will attack with the same weapon against a different creature that is within five feet of the original target. So the one that is immediately to its side, I will attack it. Okay. That is a 16 to hit. 16 will hit. Damage of 10 as well. Oh, plus two on both of those. I'm sorry. So it's 12 points of damage each. Okay. I All forgot right. about my bracers. Walgrim. Uh, I am going to uh, fire an arrow at whichever one he just tagged. Uh, he attacked the two front ones. Okay, I'm going to attack one on the left. All right, you're attacking the one on the left. Fourteen? Yeah. Um, Fourteen will hit. Nice. Uh, is that one D8? Three, four, four damage. Four damage. I'm gonna attack him again. Uh, natural fifteen. That'll hit. Uh, five damage. Okay. And I don't think I can bonus that can attack. I don't believe so. That would uh, be too OP for an artificer. <laughs> I can't do bonus action spells, but I don't, I don't want to cast any right now. Uh, but that's my turn. All right, uh, Yarl. Oh Lord! I'm yes. gonna. <laughs> <laughs> I'm tired of being in the water, so I'm gonna hoist myself out of the water okay. to the north wall. All right. And then I will. Uh... Where are you, Volgram? I thought you got off. I thought you got onto the. I did. Side I should too. be up there. Yeah, somewhere. Oh, if I didn't know, I, I was can't that close, hear you. I'd... Oh, can't hear it. Can't hear me. Hello, hello. Uh oh. Nope. Good job. <laughs> <laughs> I will. Uh... There we go. Okay. Uh, yeah, I'm over there. Can you move me back a little farther? <clears throat> yeah, that'd be good. <clears throat> okay. Cast mm. Sacred Flame at the northmost one. Ooh. Okay. Warlock with radiant damage? What the fuck? <laughs> Shh, nobody knows I'm a warlock. I dress like a wizard. <laughs> <laughs> uh -oh, didn't you introduce yourself as one? No, no he said me. wizard. Oh, he said, you said it. He said wizard. I said, well, before he got here, warlock. Yeah, oh. it's fine. <laughs> My bad. It was supposed to be a secret, Matt. <laughs> <laughs> uh, that is a 14. 14 will hit. All right, so that's 2d8. Nine points of damage. Nine points of damage. Okay, you see this one right here? Erupt into a holy flame. 
of bright radiant energy. And just poof, and then ash into the air. Oh. That's dead. I, I don't take kindly to undead. All right. <laughs> <laughs> Anything else? Uh, still have a bonus action. No, I'll just stick with that. I don't think I have any bonus action. Really? Yeah, that'll be it. Soma? Alright, so... How... How far... It, wait, is the one... Is the southern one on top of the bridge, or is he under the bridge? He's on top of it. He's on top of it. How far is he from me, roughly? Uh... Five... 20, 25, 30. Okay, I'll 30. move. I'll move 10, 10 feet to 10 feet closer. And then I'm going to take my, my two handed maul and just whoosh and chunk it at him. Okay. You're, you're throwing? <laughs> Throw All your right. maul. All right. That's cocked, damn it. That was good too. <laughs> uh well with, with a plus eight to hit that's seventeen. Uh that'll hit. Okay. <clears throat> uh that will be uh, uh eleven points of damage. That's bludgeoning. Okay. You huck your hammer, flies through the air, just takes purchase right into his face, knocks him back over, hammer disappears, reappears into your hand. Hey, it worked. Awesome. <laughs> Boof. Falls over. <laughs> that was cool. Does, does it knock him into the water or does he just fall over there? He falls onto the ground. Okay, cool. You slowly see his caved-in skull start to slowly knit itself back together. All right. In that case, uh, seeing that, I will go ahead and rage. Okay. And you rage. Because that shit pisses me off. Deep breath, buddy. <laughs> and I will spend a little bit more movement, the, the little bit left I have just to climb out onto the uh, the southern pathway. All right. So now you're on the path. All right. Is that your turn, Soma? Yes, sir. All right. Now it is going to be Mr. Zombie. Mr. Zombie that took a shot to the head has his skull knit back together and he's going to stand back up. And mm, are you going to move 10 foot closer? That one floats away into the river. Uh, the other two will go ahead and see if they can get to you. All right, these skeletons are gonna come up and flank you, or not flank you, but uh. Surround me. Uh, kind of surround you against the wall. And let's see if they can actually get some hits on you. <laughs> Good luck. That's a 12 to hit from one. Miss. And the other. Ooh, that's a 20. Natural? No, 20 total. Okay, yeah. I was really hoping you were going to say miss and I just. <laughs> no. Eight. Eight damage? Eight, eight damage from that one. Uh, half to four? Half to four because of rage. Because it is slashing damage. <clears throat> uh, 
Okay. Do I, do I have any reaction? No, I don't. Okay. That's their turn. Now it's Roshar's turn. Oh my god. So I see these things swarming him. And, uh... I will get back up. I want to reposition myself. I want to use my movement to go to towards the north. Okay. Across directly across from Soma. Not melee. It's a, it, it's a bad habit because you're a barbarian, man. <laughs> You would go from melee to ranged <laughs> for the one shot. You want to be back up there still in the uh, sewage? Or... I'm not going to try to climb out. That's going to cost me some time. All right. So I, so he's in melee with two of them? Uh-huh. Are they within five feet of each other? Yeah. Okay. So I will attack the one that's closest to me. Okay. With the 20 to hit. All right, that'll hit. And that's uh, eight points of damage. Okay. Go ahead and take your other one. And then using Horde Breaker, I will attack another one within five feet of it. Oh, I'm sorry. I get to attack twice. Yeah, and then Horde Breaker. And then Horde Breaker. So I screwed myself earlier. No, I think you attacked twice and then Horde Breaker. No, I attacked no, once. Oh, no, you didn't. Yeah, that's right. I did one and one. Uh, 18, let's see, 18 to hit. Oh, that's going to hit. With five points of damage. All right. And then the second attack... Is a nat 20. Nice. Okay, hold on one second. Did you shoot the same one twice in a row? The closest one, I yeah. shot once. You shot him once, then you shot the other one. So should I have shot the first one twice no, no, and no, then no, Horde no, Breaker no. shoot the other one? No, no, no. I'm just, I'm asking you where, who you shot for my keeping track of. Okay, so the ones directly north of Soma, I shot once. Right, and then the other one you shot after that. And then... You did five damage to him. The other one to the right of him. Right. Okay. I shot and then, once, and oh, I'm shooting a second time. Okay. Which was an at twenty. All right. So double the dice, which would be eight plus three is eleven plus two damage from the bracers is thirteen. All right. Okay. So that was the one that was on the right then. Yes. All right. That one you see explode into a pile of bones and then you begin to see the bones start skittering across the ground again and uh i have a bonus action but i'm just going to use my bonus action to yell out to them they're just going to keep putting themselves back together hold on i'm sorry uh that was a natural 20 so never mind that they start to skit together but they stop My bad. okay no, then I don't say that, and I'll just wait my turn. That's the end of my turn. Okay. I'm running a kind of a homebrewish undead fortitude uh, rule for mm. this stuff. Uh, okay, so Valgrim? Uh, I'm going to firebolt the one uh, just north of uh, Soma. Okay. Oh, God damn, I could have stopped doing that. Uh, that's not great. 13. 13 will hit. Oh, nice. Cool. Uh, what damage does that do? I know my spells and how they work. Oh, that's 2d10. Firebolt! Um, 11. 11. Okay, yeah. That one, you see uh, explode into a pile of bones. And slowly you see the bones creep together. Super cool. Fire damage doesn't kill them. I was hoping it did. Uh, I'm actually rolling really well. Surprise, surprise. 
So they get a chance to save to come huh? back. That's nice. Undead fortitude. Like I said, I'm running a homebrew rule on. That's cool. Not You're fine. Super far off from original, but okay. Um, Yarl. All right. Um, I'm just gonna sacred flame the one that's reforming because he's not gonna get a chance. Okay. <laughs> it's a uh, nineteen. Into a pile of dust. He's gone. And anything else you want to do? Uh, start moving towards the center of the cross. Yeah, about there. Roshai just dies. <laughs> just kick him into the water as I go by. <laughs> you rub your Push. turn robe on my face. Ah! <laughs> oh, oh, <laughs> Oh, it's All, right. Mouth. All right, so much your turn. All right, I am going to rush forward at the guy in front of me, and during my rush, I'm just going to fucking just... Ah! Smash him to pieces. Yeah. Uh, that's going to be a... Crap, I'm on the wrong tab. Uh, 17? Oh, yeah, that'll hit. Why did I put my damage dice away? That's all right. You blow him into pieces. Okay, with cool. your attack. And then the bones begin to skit a little bit together. And then begin to re-knit themselves once again. You still have a second attack. Hit it again. I get two attacks? Don't you? Level again. five? I thought or am I mistaken? Uh, level five barbarians. Unless you took a attack, yeah. Unless you took a level in something else. Yeah, barbarians aren't good. Okay. Like two attacks. Yeah, I'm not looking at your character sheet right now. For some reason, I thought you got two. Uh, I I do yeah. if yeah. I'm if I'm uh, frenzy raged. Ah, uh, okay. No, you still you get extra attack at fifth level. Where does I don't it? I don't see that anywhere on here. Uh, look above your um. Like, yeah, at the top um, of actions, actions, it'll say attacks per action. Oh. Does oh, it say two? whoops! It says two. Yeah, okay. See, <laughs> my bad. Insane. I have a barbarian. I've studied this. I was gonna say okay. it wasn't insane. I'm sorry. Okay, so yeah, I'll attack. As, I'll I'll attack the. It, you said it's a pile of bones trying to put themselves together. Yeah, you can go ahead and attack I'm gonna, the pile of bones. I'm gonna attack the pile of bones. Fuck attack them. the pile of bones. Uh, miss, that is miss, a. Miss. Does he get advantage? Fifteen. Uh, <laughs> He doesn't need advantage. Well, I'll tell you what. Roll with advantage. <laughs> but you've hit with 15. Roll for Gallagher. Roll for 20. <laughs> <laughs> the, okay, so this one's better. It's uh, uh, it 24. Ah. All right. More All damage. Right. Hold on. Mm. All right, I'll let you roll damage. You don't 13. Really, it's not necessary. <laughs> it's All not right. necessary. You smash the bones into pieces. Turn them into powder and dust, and you don't see them kind of begin to knit themselves back together. Fuck those bones. <clears throat> All right, and that's going to be the end of initiative. All right. All right. So now, you all have a direction of... Pull up my thingy majigger here. While we There's were running north. around, we didn't trigger any traps, did we? No. Hmm. There is, uh, y'all weren't really. You haven't hit them yet. <laughs> Just put it like that. Uh, there's north. You, you came from the west. You have the north, the east, and south to go. They came from the south, so maybe that way. If it means I get to kill him. Got a heart on for zombies, don't you? They need to die. <laughs> that is why I am here. Plain I'm and simple. Here. I'm here because <laughs> I'm getting paid. Fuck it, south we go. All right. Uh, are you making any investigation checks? Oh, yeah, I'll check. Not me. <laughs> I'll assist. Oh, good. Do I get advantage, or is he just also investigating? Y'all are both investigating each. Oh, good. 
What'd you see? Uh, not much. Not much. 20, 22. <laughs> um, you investigating the right or left side? 13. So. Of the south. Uh, if we're heading to the south, yeah, uh, I'm closest to that right hand side, but I would be opposite of him since we've been doing this for some time. So, so whichever side east, he's not, you're checking east side. East side, you find a few traps sprinkled throughout that walkway again. Uh, west side, uh, Road 13. Yeah, there's nothing there. <laughs> oh, cool. You see, it's perfectly safe. <laughs> Lead the way, Soma. <laughs> I lead the way. <laughs> Trust me, my friend. I'll stay <laughs> in the water. Really just... <laughs> All right. Yo. I'll travel in the water. All right. So, Roshire is going to travel in the sewage. Yeah, I will too. Yeah. Carl's traveling in the sewage. Soma, you're walking on the cobble, aren't you? <laughs> if, if they're in the sewer, I'll just jump in the sewer. I'm okay. Not gonna... You're going to jump into the sewer. Uh, Volgrim. I see everybody jumping in the water, and I'm like, uh... You're like, hey, there's plenty of room up here on the cobble. <laughs> there's no traps. What are you doing, Volgrim? You know, herd mentality. I'm gonna try to get on someone's shoulders again. Tell me you letting him on your shoulder? Yes. All right. <laughs> Thanks, buddy. Begrudgingly. <laughs> <laughs> Dex check. Oh, boy. From whom? From Volgrim. Oh, okay. To see if he can stay balanced. I'm rolling like hot ass. That's ten. <laughs> Can I use yeah. can I use my athletics to hold him up there? <laughs> hey, it's fine. You 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 okay. you grab his uh you grab his ankles and stabilize him a bit, and he's 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 good now. All right, so y'all travel south. Mm. Oops. Uh, helps if I l bring up my uh, equipment. Ah, there we go. Boop. All right, so there we travel south. And you see a blind corner heading east. I continue through the poop water. All right. Bargum just. Uh, uh. <laughs> yeah, I'm so just bad. muttering to myself like, "Gonna have to get." Can, this can I can I run a uh, investigation check or something to see if I see another uh, another dead rat in the water? Sure. <laughs> DC five. Sick. What's this fail. passive perception? <laughs> I'm pretty sure his passive perception is higher than that. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I rolled a 7 plus. You find a rat. I, 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 I offer it to Volgrim. No, why are you picking these up? Why are you picking these up? <laughs> I thought you might want one. Why would I want one? I don't know. You do experiments on stuff. Not on animals. <laughs> <laughs> All right, I throw it over my shoulder. <laughs> I definitely dodge it. <laughs> Who's behind him? <laughs> I don't know if anyone Probably be me. <laughs> <Yarl. laughs> uh, rat flies by your head. Doesn't hit you, fortunately. Okay. <laughs> Splashes behind you. Poop water goes everywhere. It gets a little spray on you. Oh. At this point, it's, <laughs> I, it doesn't matter to me anymore. <laughs> All right, y'all are heading east? Yep. Ooh. Jesus Christ. As uh, you... I gotta turn oh, it down God. a little bit. It's, it's super loud. It was startlingly loud. <laughs> as you... Yeah, my bad. Uh, as you head to the east and you come treading through the water, you see... a massive horde of zombies. Oh, God. I look at Volgrim and I go, did you say you had fireball? <laughs> I was joking. I do have similar stuff. Boom shakalaka. <laughs> <laughs> How far down is that? It's like 30 feet or something? 30, 40 15, feet? 15, 30, yeah, 30 foot. 30 foot drop? God damn. How much HP does Soma have left? More than most of the other characters have max HP. Probably, yeah. What, what is your health? I, I'm my max health or my current? Both. Uh, I'm at 57 of 75. Oh, you're God! Right. <sighs> I'm fine. 
You're way better off okay. than most of us. I rolled really well on my you hit You see a monstrous amount of zombies making howling noises, as you hear right now. It, it sounds like chanting for a fight arena, but it's not. It's zombies. Trust me. Uh, <laughs> and a treasure chest. Ooh, treasure. Down at the very bottom. Ooh, shiny. Trying to entice us with bullshit. Is that that little wooden box thing but on the left bottom corner? Yeah. Yeah. Now, um, <clears throat> uh, do me a favor. I need everybody to roll a stealth check. Oh, hey, something I'm not good at. Okay, wait. So if we're going to try to stealth... All right, never mind. <laughs> I didn't... Well, it's just one of those things. If we're getting up there, if it's something that we're going to discuss, if we're going to try to actively sneak, well, I can this, assist with that. But if I this is one, something you're wanting us to just try to be quiet to do... This is, this is your party coming up onto an area you had no idea of. Okay, so we need to roll to for see stealth. see what level of attention that y'all will gauge from the horde. Alright, that's fair. 15 for me. Okay. 18. Okay. 12. Okay. 19! Oh yes. Yeah. Okay, no problem, no problem. The horde, has, the horde hasn't caught wind of your uh, of your appearance yet. So, they're all stumbling around in the bottom of the uh, 30 foot down in this pit what would so, you like to do so can we we can see them from where we're at yeah so whoa 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 turn down just a bit more if uh there's no way we're gonna if we're gonna try to sneak by these guys I can assist with this Do we want to sneak? I mean, that's our goal here, right? To get rid of these things? Yeah, I I need to kill these. Listen. I have an urge. Oh, damn, we don't have two fighters. <laughs> we don't have any fighters. Well, two, <laughs> sorry, two melee characters. Okay. <laughs> I'm two. Uh, yeah, but you can only block one pathway. Mm. Oh no, there's only one pathway up to us. Mm-hmm. So look, we put them all in a line and we just start burning them down. I am 100% for this. Like, so much so that I'm already getting out of the water. <laughs> oh god, alright. Here we go. Isn't that what you want to do? You want to kill dead guys? Yeah. All right, I'm going to I'm going to get out of the That's 3 out of 4 of us are for this. So, I'm going to get out of the water <laughs> and I'm going to start I'm going to start hugging that northern wall heading towards that staircase. All right. God, I'll just position myself where I can see them going up the stairs cuz I know what's coming. I'm going to pick up Volgrim and throw him in the pit. I was kidding. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Okay. So, Volgrim, you're walking along the north side, going this direction. Affirmative. Um. Uh. uh no, Roshire. Soma was. I mean, Soma. Soma Roshire. Yeah. Roshire, where are you going? I'm gonna stand pretty much right there where I am at the edge, where I can see that stairwell. Where if they try to start going up the stairs, I can keep start picking them off. Okay. Uh. And Volgrim. I am gonna be. I'm gonna be over here somewhere. You're uh, gonna be over here? Yeah, my turret's gonna be uh, pretty much helping, like him. When, or yeah, whenever he comes over here to block the stairs, the turret will be with okay, him. Okay, so y'all are going this way. Okay, and um, uh, Yarrow, where were you? Where are you gonna be? I'm uh, head to the south wall. This way? That's, is that a larger platform down there in the southeast? This all that all is like a it's a five foot uh, rim around the outside. Mm-hmm. Okay. Uh, I think it looks like it. I believe it ends. Uh, it looks like a 10-foot platform over there. Yeah. Know. 
Okay, yeah, it turns into a 10 foot on that side. So you're going around the south side? Yeah, just like right in the middle, basically. Oh, Lord. Okay, I need Soma, I need Balgrim, and I need Jarl for deck saves. We did check for traps. Seventeen. Uh, uh, Dex. Jesus Christ, I can math. I kept trying to roll invest or put twenty-one. Uh, thirteen. Thirteen. Yeah. Okay. Jarl. As you walk around to the south side, a section of the wall. Oh shit! Just junk and just shoves. Five foot out and hits you. Okay. You bounce. Oh off my the god! Wall, and as the wall retracts, you're able to reach out and grab your hand onto the ledge, and you are <gasps> hanging off the ledge. Soma and Balgrim, y'all both at the same time traveling on the north side. As y'all are walking, the wall <laughs> extends out. Five foot and shoves. Soma and you both get busted outwards. Soma, you're able to reach out and grab the ledge and hold on. Balgrim, not so much. Oh boy. Balgrim goes flying towards the horde. Soma, I need you to give me a Constitution save. No shit my pants. <laughs> Uh, let's see. What, what, what They'll never know I'm going to shit anyway. You're asking you know Soma what? or Volgrim? No, 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 Soma. I need you to give me an athletics check. DC 20 Oof. to catch Volgrim or else he falls into the zombie pit. You better catch me. God damn it. Uh, with, with, <laughs> with a plus seven... That's a 13. Oh, shit. <laughs> oh. Oh. God almighty. Balgrim, you're launched. And you see Soma ah, reach out to try to grab you, but whiffs. And you land prone down into the zombie pit. Great. You take... All of the damage. Uh... Give me an athletics check. Oh boy. Yeah, something I'm good at. Hey, thanks, Dice. You're so good to me. Uh, what is. I was about to say, I don't even have. A seven. A seven? Yeah. I'll give you advantage. Oh, good. Jesus Christ. Oh, shit. That's a nat 20. You'll take half damage. Oh, boy. <laughs> so dead you take 10 points of damage i'm so dead you were dead no but i am going to be oh shit all right so now oh, you are down you are very much the uh after after the loud uh cacophony of sounds um they are very the horde is very much aware of your existence no, really? And you, uh, <laughs> Algrim, you're prone. Uh, Soma, you and Jarl are holding onto the ledge. Uh, we're going to go, here's what we're going to do. I'm going to give y'all each one free action, and then we're going into initiative, okay? So, starting with Soma. Um... We're, we're, we're not allowed more than one thing to do, right? I Depends. Tell me what you're going to try and do. I would like to do... I would like to rage. Okay. And let go of the wall. <laughs> Wait, would, would I still be raging from the last time? Or no, would, your, would rage, it... your rage is wore off. In that okay, travel. okay. That's kind of what okay. I figured. Okay, so yeah. I'll allow it. You can rage and fall down. Yep. Okay, so you rage and you kick off the wall. Uh, I tell you what, give me a d20 roll. 
Uh, 16. 16? Okay. You land on one of the zombies. Nice. Uh, you do... Six points of damage to that zombie. Not bad. Do I land on my feet? Yeah. Uh. We, if you're talking, we can't hear you. I, I I'm thinking. I'm sorry, I gotta prep. Uh. He's gonna kill his adventures before they get to see his bad guy. We can't hear you guys. Oh, yeah, definitely cannot all. hear you. Okay, there we go. Sorry about that. Hey, did, okay, so the I, I landed on a zombie and did six damage. Yeah. Yes. That's the last I heard. Yeah, you landed on the zombie and you did six damage. Did I land on my feet? Yeah, you landed on your feet. You landed on top of the zombie. That's why you did six damage. The zombie got knocked prone and you're standing on top of him. Raging. Cool. All right. Mm. All right. That was yours. Um, Bulgrim. Uh, as I stand up, I'm going to push the turret off my back and activate it in uh, uh, flamethrower mode. Oh, what? Oh, what? <laughs> flamethrower <laughs> mode. I'll give you use that for me. You got one over there? This is your turret. Okay. What is uh, that? Uh, You're kind of surrounded right now, so... Fuck, I don't want it there. <laughs> you don't really have an option. Can it be on the other side of... uh, uh What's his face? So Because yeah, then that'd be ten foot away. Wow. Five foot is going to put it right here. Okay. That'll have to do, I guess. Um... <sighs> Okay. Uh, Yarl. Okay, uh, that first ledge down below me, how far is that? 15? That's a 15 foot drop. Would I be able to swing over to it? And drop down yeah. there? Uh, yeah, with a proper, uh, acrobatics check, sure. Acrobatics? Okay. Yeah, I'll set the DC at... 22. Oh, well, you're fine. <laughs> <laughs> Hopefully this one doesn't push me off as well. And then I am going. As you land onto the ground, oh, what my happens? <laughs> okay, good. You're fine. You're fine. Thank God. Um, I'm gonna reach into my bag and pull out my wand of web, mm -hmm. and oh, basically, so it's a twenty foot cube. Yes, yeah, it 20, is. Twenty foot cube. Ooh. Uh, can I get basically? As many as I can get in the southwest corner. It's like you could get four of them. Yeah, you can get. Yeah, like right there, those four. Yeah, you can get five of them actually. This five. one, this one, this one, this one. This one. Perfect. Oh wait, no, I'm sorry. It, even if it's just four, like those four right in the center there, that's fine. Yeah, you can get those four right here. Okay, perfect. All right. What does that do, Creed? Uh, they are... Rest uh, each creature that takes its turn, starts to turn the web or enters, must make a dex saving throw. On a failed save, they are restrained. Ah! I died. <laughs> you can make a strength check as an action to escape it. He's got zip ties! <laughs> Amazing! I forgot I needed something to be able to identify... Status effect. Yeah, I'm gonna have to 3D print some stuff. No, just get some different colored zip ties. <laughs> it's we'll just have a legend over here, like, red is, is immobilized. <laughs> Yeah, I have a 3D printer. <laughs> if you've you got can a 3D do the, printer, there's do the cool thing stuff. that uh, Crit Roll did at the beginning where they used the little Coke. Uh, yeah, oh, the, of, the bottle rings. The bottle rings, rings. The yeah. Bottle rings, yeah. <laughs> yeah. All right, so those four right there are uh, within the web. Okay, awesome. and uh, awesome. now, um, lastly, Roshark. Okay, so I'll just watch everybody leap and fall from this 
ledge, I will not. I will stay at the top where I'm at, where I have advantage point. And the ones closest to Soma, I will take an attack. Actually, I'll cast uh, Hunter's Mark. Okay. You will Hunter's Mark. Closest to Soma. Of course, I don't have any other colors. The, the prone one or the closest one that's standing up? I can't yeah, tell which one's prone from this angle. That one. There's one prone. Okay, I don't want to shoot there. the prone one. I want to shoot the one that's uh, next the to Val. Guy, the guy with the giant carrot. Gotcha. Giant one's carrot. on the ground. I don't want to shoot the one on the ground. I want to shoot the one that's... Hunter's Mark. There you go. He's been Hunter's Marked. Okay. Help me remember, TJ. Okay. <laughs> I've got a lot of black zip ties going now. <laughs> uh, okay. So you've Hunter's Marked and you're... Okay, now I need everybody to roll initiative. That's uh, rough. Hey. Are you? Fu- <laughs> <laughs> what? I love it when the DM says that. <laughs> Son of a. All right. You're still probably fine. I rolled twenty-five, poorly. twenty. Uh, 20, uh, shit, 21. Okay. Uh, 2015? 15. Oh, <laughs> Jesus Christ. Uh, 15, 10? Nope. Nope. 10, 5? <laughs> 8. 8. What? Decks off. Who has better decks between Jarl and Soma? Uh, 4. Plus you 4 have, for me. You have a plus 4, I have a plus 3. Okay. All right. Jarl first and so And the zombie horde. Natural freaking one. Hmm. <laughs> Does that mean they all trip? <laughs> Simultaneously. <laughs> <laughs> the hell is that? <laughs> Flash mob. <laughs> <laughs> I need one more. And then... Redeem yourself, die! Nope, you piece of crap. <laughs> yes. Probability's biting you in the ass. All, right. All those high rolls last time is setting him off. That was All right, movie. here we go. Oh, I can use my counter builder, duh. Here we are. All righty. So, top of the round, we have Volgrim. Oh, you want me to go ahead and go? Yeah. Yeah, you're, 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 you're at the top of the round. round. Yeah. It sounded like you had words coming after that. Um, let's see. What am I here? Sorry. Oh, that's me. <laughs> Uh, you know, I'm just going to go ahead and get ahead of this right now. I'm going to cast Cure Wounds level 2 on myself. Oh, thank okay. God. Uh... Ooh, nice. Uh, that is 15 health. 15 health restored. And then as a bonus action, I'm going to command my uh, robot to go over there beside, uh, what's his face? Soma? Uh-huh. And then I'm going to have it flamethrower back this way to hit uh, those two in front of us. It's a 15 foot cone. I just I don't want it to hit us. I want it to. <clears throat> so if it'll catch anyone else, that's great. But I'm, I don't know if those are close enough. Uh, I think that one. Yeah, you'll catch that one. Uh, they have to make. Uh, where's my friends go? Hang on a second. I swear I was prepared for this. I think it's a deck save. Don't lie. Uh, spell DC. Yeah, deck save. My spell DC is 16. 16. Okay, so one is the standard roll. Failure. And the other two are at disadvantage. Nice. 
failure. Failure. So they all three fail. Okay, great. They will take a lot of damage. Uh, five, five. Yeah, five, five damage. Five damage. Okay. Unfortunately, not a lot. Any okay. damage is damage at this point. Yeah. They're yeah. as close as they are. <laughs> All right. Uh, Roshire? Or, well, do you have any other... No, I was just seeing if they caught on fire, but only stuff that's not being worn or carried catches on fire. Uh, okay, Ooh, Roshire? Actually, question real quick. Okay. How far out did that fire reach? Would it have hit the web? It's a 15-foot cone, and it did catch one of them in the cone. Okay, one of them so that was in the web. The web is now burning. <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> which so all on fire now. <laughs> which will web deal uh, 2d4 if it starts its starts its turn. Okay. Yeah, that's okay. dope. Nice, right. set the web on fire! <laughs> <laughs> Alright, so that one, it's starting to burn from right there. Yes. We'll start with that one right there at 2d4 when it's, it's the, when it is its turn. Yep. Okay, Roshire. Okay, so the one out hunter's marked, I'm going to attack. Okay, go ahead and make your attack. Actually, I want a sharpshooter before I call this. Okay, sharpshooter. So sharpshooter, I'm going to take a minus five penalty to the attack roll, but it adds plus ten damage. Okay. Ooh. And that is minus five. Okay, so 15 minus five is ten plus uh, 11. 11 will hit. Ooh. Oh shit, that's low AC. God. Zombies. That was luck. Okay. The only thing I could do is bring it back at 1 HP, apparently. <laughs> that's all I'm good at doing. Okay, so. That is to hit, so that's an A, D8. So that's 8 plus 3 is 11 plus. Two from the bracers is 15, plus the hunter's mark is six, is more, is 18 points of damage. Boom! Oof. Down it goes. I want to move my hunter's mark to the next one. Take my second attack. You see this one slowly start to win, uh, um, mend its wounds. From that height, can I tell that? Don't worry about it. We'll take care of it. Roll a perception check right quick. Would I be able to tell that? I guess would be the question. Roll a perception. Uh, at this point, that's 12, 12. Nope. You can't tell. So you moved your hunter's mark and you're going to take your next attack. If you're talking, I can't hear you. Golly. Yeah, they got muted again. <laughs> That's Software fun issues. Stuff. Fun. Um, so 12. Uh, yeah, you couldn't tell, so you've moved. You've uh, so I'm, I'm going to go ahead and move to the next one and take my second attack. And okay. that is a, this is not sharpshooter. Which would be a 16, 15 to hit. 15 will hit. And that's a D8, which is 6, plus 3 is 9, plus sharpshooter. No sharpshooter. No I sharp mean, shooter. no, 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 no. I'm sorry. Plus hunter's mark. Which is 15. 15 total? 15 total. Okay. I am. Hit. Plus a 2 from the bracers is 17. Damn it. <laughs> keep forgetting the bracers. Bam. It takes an additional 2 damage. Someone looked at it the wrong way. Okay. There you go. And there's nothing within five feet of that one, correct? Nope. It took 17 damage to still up? Yep. Holy shit. Okay. Well, then that's all I can do for that. Got hard bodies in here. All right. Mm, that's uh, hot. Carl. <laughs> uh, would I be able to tell if this wall to the south is going to push me off? You make a quick investigation check. I'll tell you what. I'll make it a bonus action for you. Bonus action? Okay. Uh, <laughs> mm, that's an eight. <laughs> Looks pretty safe. Okay, cool. 
Uh, I'm going to take my Sweet. 30, 30 feet, uh, just head down the walkway. Okay. Oh, Jesus. You're fine. And then from there, I should be within 30 feet of the five closest. The ones that aren't in the web. Oh. The three on the bottom and then the two the upright. three on the bottom, and yeah, and then the two upright. You're also 15 foot in the air. That's true. He has a height advantage. He's got the high ground. <laughs> He's still f- 15. What are you, what are you fixing to do? I, I just, uh, am I within 30 feet of him? Uh, you're like, within. Like spell range wise. Four of them. The one that's Four way out there, you're not. Uh, that was a target, but okay. Um, I'm going to cast Bane Ooh. on those four. You don't have no zip ties. Four zip ties! <laughs> <laughs> yeah, sorry, all the effects. That's so it's right. a uh, Charisma 16 save. Four of them. Natural 20! So that one wins. Natural 19. Uh, Natural 1. There we go. Natural 20. Oh my god. Wow. wow. Hey, All right. You All are right. being so used. That, that one is Bane. One. <laughs> oh lord. Wow. The one that got Baned is the furthest one away from us, isn't it? The one that got Baned is... Oh, it was... The second one. It was the third, third one. one. Yeah. Oh my god. Yeah. That one, that one. <laughs> Man, two natural 20s and a 19. OG Dice is doing it for me today. We're going with you. All right. Well, there goes that. <laughs> it's when you roll at disadvantage and still get a nat 20. Yeah. All right. So, yeah, uh, he has a uh, minus d4. So, there's that. All right, help me remember that, please. Yeah. Okay. Uh, Soma. Um, yes. You got one that's in front of you, and you got Is one it, that's starting to knit himself back together. The one at my feet that I'm basically standing on top of, he is not dead, correct? He is not dead. He is prone. And does that give me advantage on the that attack? Gives you advantage. Yes. All right. Well, I have advantage because I'm raging already, but that's right. okay. Double I think. advantage. Well, if you're uh, oh no 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 that, that's a, it oh, only that's, gives you strength check yeah 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 never mind yeah never mind okay so I'm gonna attack the dude at my feet all right attack that dude at your feet uh, four uh thank God I have advantage I do have advantage from him being prone right yes yeah okay uh it's gonna be an eighteen to hit that'll hit. Uh, that's going to be 14 damage. 14 damage. Woo! Okay. Second attack. Did I shatter him? Nope. Okay. Second attack on that same target. Okay. That cocked. God. Why do all my good rolls become cocked? That sucks. Okay, that is also an 18 to hit. All right. That'll hit. Crush his spine. Uh, eleven damage. All right, you obliterate it, and you cut out. Oh, you no audio. Ask. Awesome. Creed is turned into a cat. What? It's part of his wizardy powers. Oh. <laughs> All right. Uh, you obliterated him. Excellent. I'm rolling really well when it, in a lot of his situations, uh, he begins to slowly knit himself back together. Okay. Um, as a bonus action, I would like to go into a frenzied rage. Go for your frenzy rage. Roar. Okay. And, um, I will, I will remain on top of this zombie skeleton, whatever it is. Okay. All right, that's your turn. Now it's the horde's turn. 
Sorry, she was getting into stuff. <laughs> we thought you just transformed yourself into a cat. <laughs> <laughs> wow. Not on the desk. Not on the desk. Wait, that one can't move. Nope. That one, none of those can move. Wait, this one can move. They're trying to go around the web. <laughs> <laughs> if they walk into that, do they have to make a save? Yes. Yeah, yeah nice. they enter it. Or start their turn there. So they have to enter it and leave, otherwise they have to roll for it twice. Once now and once next turn. Yep. Those are clumping up on trying to get to you. They're not really going to do anything. <laughs> trying to scratch up the walls. Line them up. They're in a giant line. They're all trying to get to you. Oh, if only I had Scorcher. Right now, only two of them can make an attack on you, Volgrim. Oh, good. Only two? Great. I'll so... tell you, I'm going to split... <laughs> oh, go ahead. You're fine. <laughs> I'm splitting them because one of them was... Actually, he got up. Yeah. The one that you're standing over, he crawled out and stood up. So he's, he's going to take an attack on you, and Volgrim, you're going to get the other one, so. Yay. Purple yep. is for... Stop that. All right, Volgrim. Yep. He swings wildly and misses you. Oh, good. And... Soma, does a 19 hit you? Yes. Did that one take his 2d4 fire damage? Oh, yeah. The one that's in the web. He fire. will as soon as I finish this roll. Okay, cool. <laughs> That'll be five points. Okay. Six points of damage to you, Soma. Halved because of rage to three. And then he takes... Five. Five points? Yep. Do, 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 do. Where are you, five-point guy? Uh, you were over... I think that was... That one hadn't taken any damage until now, I believe. Uh, no, the one that was in the web and caught fire? Yeah, he took five from the, uh, okay, so that's from the, the flamethrower. Okay, so that's the guy right there. Okay, here we go. There he is. I got a lot of things, numbers in front of me. Okay, he took his he took his damage. Okay, uh, that's the zombie ah. horde turn. That and really he's a whole lot. he's no longer webbed as well. Okay, he's free. <laughs> hey, get, don't. <sighs> All right, so this is why I put you out, Chase. Algrim, top of the round. Uh, I have to use level two spells already. Um, I am going to look over and grab uh, Soma on the arm and cast enlarge on him. Ooh. Okay, Soma gets enlarged. Uh, and you could even use that for him. Ooh, that's true. And what does that do to me? Uh, it will make you. It uh, doubles all your dimensions. Your weight is multiplied by eight. Your growth, uh, you go from medium to large. Um, do to do. Uh, until the spell ends, you have uh, advantage on strength checks and saving throws. And you do an extra 1d4 of damage. Cool. An extra 1d4 is basically all I get. Nice. Yeah, sorry. <laughs> I hit everything else. <laughs> You're also big. <laughs> I'm also, yeah, You're enormous. Big. You're like the size of a... <laughs> I, I, wait, doubles my height? Yeah. Okay, I'm eight foot four. Okay, so yeah. Pretty big. big You're big. Belly. I'm yeah, a big. huge dwarf. He's a, You're a big guy he's a, now. He's and my, my weight is multiplied by eight? Eight, yeah. So I, I weigh... Uh, I weigh sixteen hundred pounds. Holy shit! Ooh, wow, <laughs> you are dense, big boy. <laughs> you thick like Campbell's soup. All I've, right, uh, 
Mulgrim? <laughs> As my bonus action, I'm gonna have the the arcane turret cast uh, flamethrower again. Same direction. Get as many as I can. Those four right there. Pick me up now, zombie. <laughs> All right. So two of them. What's the damage? Uh, seven. There should be a modifier for that. All right. So I gotta roll for three. Was it three or four? Oh, right. Once. Yeah, I don't know. All right. Your, uh, Roshire, your, uh, Hunter's Mark fell off this guy. He's dead. It just fell off him. It's like, hey, you dropped that. He's, he's purely dead. Can you hear me? Yeah, I can hear you. Oh, okay. I, I get you now. Uh. Okay. Um. So the other two look like they're starting to. Put themselves back together. Damn these zombies. I'm rolling really well. I can't help it. <laughs> All right, Roshire, do you need to go? Not yet. Not yet? I need to keep shooting people, but I'm getting there. Okay. All right, we may have to split this one up then. May have to continue next time. All right, um, Roshire, your turn. Okay, I'm still at the edge. Am I still allowed to move my hunter's mark? Yeah, you can still move it as your bonus action. Okay, since it's cast, I want to move it to the next available target. Boop. All right. And start attacking, which is uh, a 24 to hit. Good God. Okay. Natural 18. So D8... Just four plus three is seven plus the D six is two more is nine plus the bracers is eleven. Okay. Nice. Second attack on the same one. Is a oh shit, hang on, I gotta fix that. Fourteen to hit. 14 will hit. So that's 4 plus 6 is 10 plus 2 is 12. 12 points of damage. Boosh! That one goes down. Uh, is there one within 5 feet of it? Wow. Uh... No, that one actually is back a little bit. So. And that is it. Okay, and that one slowly starts to mend its wounds. I can't believe how well I'm rolling. I can. Stop, stop bragging. <laughs> <laughs> I wish I would yeah. roll well at this when it counted. Except I just kind of bringing these guys back to life. Uh, all right, uh, Jarl. Yeah, uh, bu -bu -bu -bu. that's a pretty good crowd control going on here, actually. Decent enough. Okay, I'm gonna summit. Well, I'm gonna tap my staff on the ground, and it's just you know how you like do one of these and you pump a shotgun. I do mm -hmm. that, and it turns into a crossbow. Dope. So, and then I'm going to... St still lit up, by the way. Still got the light on the front. <laughs> <laughs> and then... Sorry. Now you're spotlighting. Essentially, yeah. <laughs> That's illegal. <laughs> then I'm going to take sewer. <laughs> a shot at the one in the bottom left corner. That one? Yeah. 
Okay, roll your attack. That will be 21. 21 will hit. Okay. That'll be 12 points of damage. Okay. And I will shoot again. 19. That'll hit. For 13 points of damage. Ball's over. This is a different die. Ah, this one stays dead. Oh, thank goodness. Nice. And I believe that'll be it. Okay. Uh, Soma? Uh, am I... I'm within five feet of two of them, right? They're dusty. They Well, those are the ones that are uh, knitting themselves back together. All right, I will pick one of them that is knitting itself back together that's within five feet of me and smash the ever-living crap out of it. <laughs> smash it. Smash it with a hammer. Uh, 16 to hit? You hit. Do I need to roll da damage no, on you it? You don't have to roll damage. They're one okay. hit point. That one slowly starts to put itself back together. I hit but, that. I hit that bastard again. <laughs> Never mind. I'll wait for my turn. God dang. Uh, thir thirteen to hit. <laughs> okay. Cat. Does he? Does he? Is he still knitting himself back together? Are you shitting me. I rolled two 17s in a row, yes. All right. Frenzied attack. My okay. I, In a frenzied rage, I can bonus action attack a third time. Go for it. Uh, that is a, uh, it's a 24 to hit. Okay. Uh, Roll again. <laughs> is he knitting back together again? All right. Hold on. Roll damage. Roll damage. Okay. Legit I'm gonna, damage. I'm, I'm I'm gonna I'm I gotta I gotta modify this rule. Uh fifteen fifteen bludgeoning. Fifteen? Yeah. <laughs> no, this one doesn't make it actually. Alright. <laughs> Th took three hits to powderize those bones. <laughs> Alright, so which one was that? Okay, perfect. Is the uh it's kinda hard to tell. There's one that's hunter's mark that's prone. Yeah, there's one here. And the one to the left of that, is he standing? Yeah, he's also dusty. That one's dusty. I I can I can I choose to take his position by just standing on his bones? You can stand over him. He is large. I will stand directly over the uh, I I will move. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'll I'll give vulgar room to stand behind me. <laughs> You're like standing over him. Now. All right. Okay. That's it. Uh, I'm thinking I may have to actually split this one up into two separate one-shots uh, okay. for the evening because we are a little pressed for time on certain situations. But uh, So we'll do... You got time for one more round, Curtis? Yeah, we got one more round. Okay. We'll run one more round, and then we will pick back up in two weeks for the conclusion of this one-shot. This one we get got a little bit longer than I had expected. It's a two shot. It's a two shot, yeah. <laughs> Alright. Uh zombie horde turn. That one fell into the web. Nice. All right. So those idiots can't do anything. Those guys are stuck in the web. Oh, they can make a strength save. 16 to get out. Aren't they also on fire now also? No. Just No, it was, it was just that one. Oh. It's like a bunch of individual webs. I got you. I got you. I got you. That one breaks free. That one breaks free. Two of them break free. Other two are still stuck. Oh, that's their action, so I'm okay with that. All right. Uh, then I've got two of them are going to do an attack on you, Soma. 
bring it on. I'm over there just holding on to my my mall and just like screaming at all of them. <laughs> one of them completely utterly misses. The other one gets a twenty-three to hit. That's going to be a miss. Yeah, they definitely to hit. My AC starts at twenty and goes up. Actually, it's weird like that. <laughs> wow, cat, can we not? All right, so you got here, right? Yeah, oh, absolutely. Twenty-one. All right, twenty-one. Absolutely. <laughs> one D. Ah, two points of damage. Reduced to one. to one. <laughs> yeah. All right. That's the horde's turn. They're they're clumping pretty hardcore, but they can't get to anybody. And uh, Soma's got uh, Soma's got uh, Volgrim protected. So Volgrim, <laughs> it's your turn. Okay, cool. Uh, what other? F I'm just gonna start shooting at ones that I can hit without uh, disadvantage. Um, I know the dusty ones I can't without getting disadvantage or some shit. Or, uh, oh, you know what? I have a freaking plus one thingy. Yeah. Uh, I'm gonna, I never equip it. I, I would say you could probably try and attack them on the ground. I don't think it'd be that big of a deal. Okay. I'm, uh, I guess I'll shoot at the one on the ground. Okay. Um, 16 to hit. That hits. Uh, there's zombies. What the fuck is my... Oh, it's 2d10. Oh, it isn't. I'm looking at the wrong thing. Sorry. Sorry. 1d8. Uh, 4 damage. Oh, no. Sorry. 6 damage. 6 damage? Okay. So that brings that to that. To... Alright. It starts to mend itself back. Hit him again. Uh, that's... Hit again. A hit. Uh, four damage. Or no, sorry, six, six damage. Hey, that one stays dead. Great. And then I hey. use arcane turret to fire as many as I can. Arcane turret to get one, two, three, four, five. Awesome. They all take five, right? Uh, they take one. One. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> well, the DA roll. <laughs> the good news is, is I gotta make a save on one of them. No more than that. One, two, three. Oh, yeah. Fail. 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 I say technically they'd still all take one damage regardless. I know, they all took the damage. So this one, this one, this one. They died. Yeah. Damn. They failed their. They failed their save. Oh, right on. I'm okay with this. Yeah. All right. Fucking turrets, dope. Shoot. 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 End it. All right. There's still plenty of healthy zombies out there. It's okay. All right. Volgrim, uh, that's your turn. Roshire, your hunter's mark is free. Okay. So I'm going to move it to some of the ones that are closest to me. Since he's a large target, I'm not going to be able to shoot around him. Well, it's just three quarters cover for Well, I ignore three, quarter, three, three quarters cover. I ignore. Okay, so this one looks kind of messed up, and this one looks fresh as a daisy. Okay, so fresh as a daisy. <laughs> oh, can't have it. <laughs> <laughs> we'll take the first one. Go ahead. Uh, I'm going to try sharpshooter again. Sam is on a struggle bus right now. <laughs> Since that's fun. Oh, crap. Where is it? <sighs> okay, the minus five, so that was an 18 minus five is 13, plus the one is six. You hit. Or plus one is 14 to hit. You hit. You heard it here, folks. 13 plus one is six. <laughs> 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 nah. 
Hey, my barbarian. math, my head. That's barbarian <laughs> math right there. Sun is over. I can't Check hear out. you, Daniel. <laughs> oh, good. Hey, technical difficulties. It's every time the sys the software overloads. Look at CPU usage, and I don't know why it's so high. I think it's just because it's hot. ATA. Possible. Okay, so. Might have to put a mean cooler on it, I guess. It's water cool. Yeah, that'll be a mess. Okay, so the first one. Damage? Be, let's be five plus three is eight plus two from the bracers is ten plus the ten from sharpshooter is twenty plus the d6 was two more is twenty two. Rangers, man. I don't think I can save on this one. I need a d damn calculator. <laughs> <laughs> and then I'm gonna... I fail. All right, that. Yeah. All right, that's the first attack. So move the hunter's mark to the next one. Within. Okay. Yep. Yeah, that one looks messed up, but you can certainly use it. Yep. Okay, so no sharpshooter. This is the normal the straight roll, which is going to be 13 to hit. Okay. It hits. So D8 is 6, plus 3 is 9, plus 2 is 11, plus the D6 is 6 more. 17 points. 17 points. Uh, oh, yeah, that blows him away. Let's see if he saves. Nope. He's dead. Amazing. I make a rule change, and now they're starting to stick to that. Huh. All right, you can't move your hunter's mark. That's it. That's it. Uh, Yarl. Okay. Oh my god. I. Who's the closest? Looks the healthiest. Just the, the guys below me. I think all your guys. Yeah, are still they're healthy. all they're all okay. healthy. All right. They're, they're all pretty as a pitcher. I'm well, just uh, crossbow, I guess. That's a natural one. Awesome. <laughs> oh. And that is a. Where did it go? That's a twenty. Twenty will hit. Yep. For 12 points of damage. 12 points of damage. All right. And then uh, 60 feet. Do I want to do that? I probably could. Uh, bonus action, I'm going to spend 2d6 of my healing light and heal Valgrim for 8 points. Okay, heal, you, heal me? Yep, yeah. you take eight points. Oh, I didn't need that. But I'll take it. I'd healed myself already. I know, but you need it more than Matt does. <laughs> That's fair. Uh, it's also way over max. There you go, you're back to being safe. Yay. Thank you. Yep. So I use two of those. Okay. And that'll be it. Okay, Soma. Alright, okay. I'm going to travel straight south. Uh, up to that first zombie I see. Yep. And I'm going to crush his stupid head. Zombie smash. Go ahead, roll your attack. Does it get advantages of your strength? Uh, it's oh, a web, so it's is not it, going to be... Uh, uh, it's restrained. So that would which, be does that give me advantage? Uh, restrained should be advantage. It's not incapacitated, which would be an automatic crit. So yeah. Okay, advantage but advantage, yes. Okay. Yes. Uh, 17 to hit. 17 will hit. I get a plus D4 from enlarge for damage, right? Yeah. So I've, I've, well, let's start rolling that now, then. <laughs> uh, uh, 15 damage to him. 15 damage. Zombie pieces are kind of hanging in the web. I will attack him again. Okay. 
Damn. That is a 27 to hit. Oh, yeah, that'll hit. Okay. Uh, see, that's uh, 12 damage. 12 damage. Okay. Yep, that one falls. 12. That one does not come back. Okay. I'm going to saddle over like five feet so I can reach the one to my right. Yep. And I'm going to use my bonus action frenzy to attack on that guy. Go for it. Sweet. Natural 20. Nice. Do I, do I double? <laughs> double do all I, dice rolls. Including the enrage. Oh, yeah. Enlarge. It's all dice, but you don't... The modifier is what you don't what double. What I don't double, right. Alright, so it's... It's 12. Uh, uh, 14. 16. 17. 18. 19 damage total. Nineteen total. Yes. Uh, nineteen total. Okay, so that's that. It was a weak crit. Yeah, I rolled a one and a, a one to five and a one uh, one to five and a four. Mm, I think. That sucks. All right. So yeah, it's still standing. All right. Well, that's that's the end of my turn then. I'm using a home brewed undead fortitude, which I had to modify, by the way, Primus. I'm not adding the con at this point because I kept rolling literally 15, 16, 17, 18, 19s, and 20s. Yep. All right, so is that your turn, Soma? Yes, sir. All right. All right. Uh, here we're going to do something different. These zombies are going to start cluttering together and start trying to crawl on top of each other to get to you, Jarl. So. Uh, oh, okay. So we're going to do an escalated DC on this to see if they can make it. Uh, that one that's closest to me also has a minus D4. All right. Well, he's the base of the pyramid, so... This ought to be great. We'll see if he'll be able to hold everything up at the end. Uh, all right. So this is going to be... First one I'm going to set as a DC of 12 for one of them to climb on top of the other one. That is a 10. So, no, he doesn't make it. Because his dex is minus 2. The other one's going to try and climb. No, that one can't climb either. They're just kind of just... Yes. Being big, dumb zombies. Yeah, they're just kind of clobbering all of climbing on each other, just trying to get up to you and get up to that... Uh, <laughs> get up that wall, but they just can't do it. So that's those two. Jeez. This one's going to turn and... Uh, and... It's going to make ah. its way over to you. Oh, shit. I left an opening, didn't I? My bad. Frenzied rage got me confused. <laughs> it happens. Trust me. I know. All right. So I need three attacks. Two are going to be against Soma and one against Valgrim. All right. So the one that's against Valgrim is... Uh, that's an eight to hit. That's not going to hit. That will not hit you, Vulgrim. Now, the one against Soma. One of them's a natural 20, so I know that's going to hit. And the other one is an eight to hit. Uh, the eight will miss, thankfully. All right. So on the natural 20. Nine damage reduced to four damage is what you take. <laughs> that was a shitty crit, huh? I rolled a four out on a, a d6. Uh, that's, a, that's okay, then. Shit crits are okay. You just happen to have really good 
you know, slashing, you know, barbarian shit. All right, so that's the zombies' turn, and at this point in time, uh, we're gonna go ahead and pause the one shot here. We will pick back up in two weeks and continue. There is still a big boss to find. Who knows what else is inside the sewer maze? We shall see. Uh, I want to thank everybody for staying around and watching the uh, watching the show today. Uh, if you got any questions, you can be sure to hop onto our Discord. It should be in the links that we have on the Twitch chat. Yep. You can hit us up on Twitter. All our Twitter handles are under our name. Well, they were not on this screen. They were under our names. You can find us. We're everywhere uh, in the Discord. And you can also check out everybody else's Discord. Uh, I guess that's going to be it. So, uh, guys, thanks for joining me today. Yeah. Thanks for having us. And we will see everybody next week, 12 o'clock, when we continue our campaign, our persistence campaign for attacking the darkness. So goodbye, everybody. Goodbye.